What's up, everybody? How is everyone doing today? Hope everyone is slightly ready for more Digimon gameplay. Uh, let's see. Did we ever talk to him? I don't think we did, right? Let's go talk to him. Guess not. Grown a bit more. Then let's head somewhere else. Never underestimate the power of free stuff. Rio. What? There's nothing around here. Hurry back. Jeez, such a coward. But he still acts like he's the one in charge. Maybe I should tease him a little. Nah, I'll leave him be. Thought about moving around for a bit. Okay, I should take a look around too. It would be dangerous. Stay close, okay? Yeah, I know. For you, it's hard to handle, huh? Yeah, enough already. I'll follow you. Better if he comes and helps instead of staying here terrified. That's why we encourage the man. I still need to get... Uh, what's her name again? To join, don't I? <clears throat> Yamum. Um, no, you're still in the level. Critical, nice. Assist. Attack. Nice. 
Yes. Victory! change this one here. You may move. Oh, we might as well try. Just one new moon, right? All enemies defeated. Start battle. his head as he starts to leave. Shh. So there's even more on the edge. And what the humans are saying. Talk to him slowly. Okay, this is just enough to actually get the... Uh, Command. 39% chance, sad. Victory! Big bandage, nice. I know I can do an evolution towards Numemon, but I don't with uh, Gotsumon. But I don't think that's at all useful if we can just capture it. Talk. Mm. Scowling at you. Look apologetic. Nar trying to say something. Give it some food. You know that that one worked. Looks calmer. Monster just stands there. Gesture. Nice. Don't think uh, having more up there on the bar increases the success rate. Store start with SP. Meat looks pretty tasty, but somehow I don't think we can eat it. Temple. Looks like there's something on the other side of the rock gate. Seems like a cave inside. No way, really? There's something here, I can feel it. 
shrine gate still seems the same. Old shrine probably as well. That shadow. Yeah. Shadow. Talk command. Gazimum. I didn't actually check what Gazimum's evolution line is gonna be like. I feel like just talking to them. Tough looking mug, aren't you? Bad lose that we threw down. Uh, have more confidence in work, and we probably tie is probably a better one than. I don't care if you smile or laugh or whatever, ain't gonna trust no human. Fine by me? No. Makes me want to yawn. I thought I did that one last time. I'm so bad at this. Talk. Let's try it again. What I think of you. I'm easy going. And that was the one. Okay, I know this one. Oh, you scared me. Uh, wasn't it completely at least? We'd probably tie. Chest. 
Resolve Pack. Let's go to Aoi and Labramon. Nothing here either. Yeah, you're right. Maybe they went somewhere farther out. But it's weird that they would head... They wouldn't head for the school. I wonder if something happened. Well, I don't know what might have happened, but I'm ready to keep looking. You're right. All we can really do this at this point is keep on the search. There's nothing there. If we found Professor Hat, then Saki and the others should be alive. Please, Aoi, cheer up. We'll find them. Let's keep looking. You're right. But it's no good. I keep overthinking this. What's the matter, Aoi? I'm really anxious about this, even if we find everyone. I don't think I'll, it'll change anything. What do you think won't become of us? What, what in the world is happening here? My mother and my father, will I ever see them again? It'll work out, even if we're stuck here. What? We have food and water, we have shelter and blankets, we can fight too. I think we can make it, but... That should be enough for now, right? We still don't know enough, but let's not worry about the unknown. That'd be easier for sure. I guess that's true. Thank you, Takuma. That helped. I'm glad Aoi is feeling better. It's wonderful when she smiles. Thank you for listening to me. I think I'll look around here a bit longer. Sure. Okay. See you later. Nothing else? I wonder if he found any clues about the professor. Spider Lily is still the same. Suspicious thicket. I found a thing, Takuma! A learning crystal. No idea, but I think it could be useful. I'll hang on to it. Really? You don't know what it's for? It doesn't look dangerous. I'm sure it'll be fine. You say so. I have a feeling that that might be a uh, XP bonus thing, yeah. Guard break. Mm, yeah, no, that's fine. And then give you guard charge for the time being. Any clues, Takuma? Nope, not at all. You? Same, same. They are not around here. Damn it, where could they have gone? Calm down, Minoru. Let's stay focused on the search. You're right. Stay calm. Listen carefully. You'll surely hear something. It's no good. I can only hear the rustling leaves. Hmm. He seems to have calmed down. That's why you make me do that? You make a good team, don't you? You think so? Well, if Falcomon thinks so too, I'll, it'll be easier to believe. And I trust you as well, Minoru. I accept your strengths and your weaknesses. 
Stop, you're embarrassing me. I trust you too, Takuma. Sting each other and working together. Brothers in arms. That has a good ring to it, brothers in arms. We fight together, cool. So watch each other's back, that's perfect. It's not bad. It has the it has the ring of truth too. We'll fight together to survive together. When I'm Takuma's brother in arms too! Counting on you, Minoru. That's my line. <laughs> anyway, we need to find Saki and the others as soon as possible. I'll leave this area to you, Minoru. You bet. Hmm, they're not around here. Where did they all go? Did you find something, Takuma? No, not really. Yeah, I'll keep looking around back here. Let me take a look at around the school again. We might have just missed them. I'm also worried about Miyuki and Haru. I'll follow you. With no signal, we need to stick together. Get going then. When it's looping so hard, why haven't we found them yet? They must be hungry. I just realized that now. Yeah, but that's not too important. Hunger makes you irrational, and it makes it hard for survival. And you're sad when you're hungry. That's why we need to find them. We got to get them some food, yeah. Huh? Labramon, you okay? There's a scent here, but I can't tell where exactly. Something hiding out there? I'm not sure whether it's friend or foe, but it's a strong scent. There are traces of something around here. Traces? But nowhere else? Something might show up on camera. Take a look, Takuma. Takuma! Whoa! What is this? The footprints of a bunch of creatures. The professor is in danger. They're heading away from us. To the shrine! Something dangerous coming? I hope the professor is safe. Hey Takuma, I heard a voice inside the shrine. Might be one of those monsters. Let's check it out, but be careful. Going inside? We're going inside that? We'll be in life! Saki and the others are inside. We need to help them. Let's go. Yeah, okay. It's over here. Come on. Hey, it's the professor. He's alright. Is he alright? Wouldn't exactly call him alright. What happened? It looks like he's been beaten up and he's collapsed. Hey, wait a second. There's something around him. You're right. He's surrounded by Gazimon. Are they enemies? Whoa, I think one just looked this way, whoops. Because I shout so loudly. Nah, I think we would have been spotted there either way. The question is, are they good guys or bad guys? Can they even talk like Falcomon or Agumon? What's their deal? Hey, what gives? Is this old guy still breathing? Who knows? And really, who cares? We better report back to Fangmon. It talked. Are there others that can talk? And what is Fangmon? They're talking, they can talk. Minerik's gonna talk to them. You're going alone? That's too risky, I'll go with you. That'll scare them. We don't know if there's more. Just see if I can... If you can find help, I'll be back. Um, hi there, we come in peace. Who's this windbag? Clear out, punk! Uh, these guys are really bad all over. Well, you see, fellas, I figure we could be friends, yeah? This might be a lost cause, even to nego... For, even for a negotiator like Minoru. I don't like this, Takuma. I don't think they're the talking type. Leave the coot. It's those human brats we're after. Yeah, where'd they run off to? Hey, hold on a second. Then we got a brat right here. Uh-oh, they're all looking at Minoru. Huh, oh, uh, not good. Perfect! All we gotta do is grab this one. Let's rough him up a bit so he doesn't try and run off. Hey, they're getting closer! What? There's more at the exit? What is this voice I hear? Just listening makes my blood freeze. I can't see the monster that is speaking, but it's a dangerous one. Can't see it. Then what are we supposed to do? 
It's not even looking. Some nerve. Hey, Minoru in front. Ah! Yeah! I won't let you lay a finger on him. Volcomon. Huh? And who invited you? Now, Minoru, make your escape. Why are you siding with a human, are you? Nah, I bet you just want to be human's power for yourself. We won't let you have it. Take this! Falcomon. Oh no, Falcomon took hits for Minoru. Not, not a problem. This is bad. Those guys are out for blood. Let's go, Agumon. Yeah! It's now or never. Let's fight with everyone. Labramon? Yes, let's do this. All of us. All of us. <clears throat> uh, cannot let Agumon face them on his own. Stop the Falcomon. You can't fight with injuries like that. It is but a trifle. I cannot allow them to lay a hand on you. Falcomon, I'm so sorry. So sorry. I'm so, so sorry. That's better English, Shorty. I've been too careless this whole time. The fact that you got injured at all is my fault. Instead of criticizing me for it, you protected me. Got hurt for your pro trouble. Scared, is there any way we can escape? Do not debase yourself, Minoru. You are not usually so craven. Falcomon. Now then, here I go. I will be your opponent. Huh? Still looking for some punishment? Ah, it's too dangerous, Falcomon. Minoru, I can't believe you jumped in front of me. <laughs> My body moved on its own. I just want to protect you, buddy. Ouch. Like I have what it takes to protect anyone. <laughs> pathetic. Ah, I'm so ashamed. You're not pathetic. I understand your strength, Minoru. As well as your kindness. Worry not. If you have that spirit, and if you truly feel regret, if you want to get stronger, then you will, Minoru. I'm sure of it. Falcomon, I can feel it, your desire for strength. Falcomon, Digifolf 2! Your heart protected me, so it makes me so happy. It makes me so happy. No, so. <sighs> I'm just reading part of the line and making things up as I go, right? It makes me so happy. <laughs> Falcomon Digivolve 2! What? What is this? Oh, not bad at all. Falcomon? Your power becomes my own, Minoru. So behold, this is your power. <laughs> Whoa. Now then, here I go. Oh, we need to protect the professor, actually. Let's bring Betamon and obviously Kunimon. Professor's hurt. We have to get him to a safe place. Protect the professor until we get to that spot. Don't let his HP run out. The terrain is really uneven here. Attacking from higher ground increases your critical hit rate. Let's keep going, but keep an eye on the professor's position as well as the enemies. I can't talk to these guys, right? No.
Let's see, what is my new attack? Destructive Destruction War. Deals wind damage to target with a low chance to raise your physical attack. Oh, nice. Personally, kind of hoped it would deal damage. Um, Ninety-nine percent accuracy. Open the chest. Potency crystal. Still guarding.
just let them stand there for charging. Did the professor just assist? instinct to notice me. But enough! Let's finish those two. Am I safe? I think they let us go. That was a really scary one. Huh. That was nothing. More importantly, the professor. Yeah, the professor, are you okay? He's injured, but not critical. We need to get him somewhere safe. Victory! Potency crystal, big bandage, boost seed, and ribs. Should be safe here. Professor, does it hurt? Feeling better now, thanks to your kindness. You're welcome. But it was Iowi's idea to bring the first aid kit. Just happened to have it. But where are we? This isn't the shrine. That's what we'd like to know. Where are we? Here we have food and water. Agumon and the others drove off the enemy, so you're safe. Agumon? Hey, hey, that's me! Ha! <laughs> it's okay, Agumon isn't like the others, we're friends. Yeah, humans have nothing to fear from me. Or from me. Yeah, me neither. I see. If you don't mind, I'd like a little time to sort out my thoughts. Yes, okay, I've calmed down now. <sighs> well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. A monkey's what now? The Kemanogami, they were real all along, this is no dream. Wait, let's not jump to conclusions, I must conduct tests. I wish this was a dream, it's more like a nightmare. Is that the Seppi! One? It's okay, we're all here, and we're all on your side. Indeed. I feel as if I remember something, or perhaps cannot remember. My mind is all foggy, funk, or some kind of gas. The fog, yes, that fog is danger, stay away from it, it's, um... It's, um, Professor? Yes, yes, I see. It must have some adverse effect on one's mental state. Your unquestioned affiliation with those creatures may very well be proof. No, you ain't talking about me. Here, drink some water, then we'll return to the school. It's our base of operations. I say thank you, child. The school, I see. So you must be... Oh, oh no! What's wrong, Professor? This is no dream. Then those children... Were they able to escape that beast unharmed? I cannot sit idly by. We must save Saki and Shuji. Ugh. Hold on, Professor. Are you okay? Stay down. You mustn't move. Save them. It's crazy talk. You barely... <laughs> that's, you can barely stand. Saki and Shuji, do you know where they are? Professor, I cannot speak to their current whereabouts, but I can lead you to where I last saw them. The Professor's pretty messed up. He can't have traveled very far. 
Okay, let's look for them. I'm against this. Yes, yes, we know. Then stay here and keep a lookout, all right? Hey, I ain't gonna let you leave me behind, damn it. I'll go. How are you doing today, Sep? Anyways, we better hurry. Please be safe, you two. Obviously, we're going to look around. Do you know what this is, Agamon? Nope. Doesn't look dangerous. I'll take it. Only one way to figure it out. What is it? Energy seed. Cure all stat reductions on the target. Okay, cool. Oh wait, we were just here. Wait, maybe if I talk to Agumon, there's still something we can grab. There's something here, I can feel it. There are two somethings here, and we can feel it. That shadow. Fight it. Grab the chest. Evolution. Tyrannomore. Kunemon, Betamon, and Gotsumon are incredibly slow. Rocket Fist!
Holy shit. No, that's bad. Bandages. One button. Inner shrine entrance. I don't think there are any clues around here. You don't know that. That might pick something up. Shadow? No. Self pack. What's this? It feels like a voice or someone's conscious in my head. All in the seasoning, chapter one. Read it. That day was the first time I'd ever seen a human child. I couldn't explain it. How could I know what it was, having never seen one before? Ever so, the moment I laid eyes on her, my heart leapt. I finally met her. Hey, hey you, are you okay? Mm -hmm. The child was obvious, obviously in bad shape. It obviously... The child was obviously in a bad way. I don't know what... I don't know a thing about humans, but I could tell this one wouldn't last much longer. That baseless yet... Assured concern made me desperate to look after her. I warmed her with fire, fed her nectar. By the time the sun was high in the sky, the child finally opened her eyes. Ah, who? What? You're awake. How do you feel? Does it hurt anywhere? Huh? Uh, where? Who are you? Who, me? It's strange. I feel like you're not human. Yeah, well, I'm not like you, that's for sure. But don't be scared. I'm a good girl. Girl? You're a girl? Huh? would have thunk a creepy body like that belonged to a lady. Creepy? Of all the rude things to say, and after I looked <laughs> and after I looked after you all this time. Huh, you looked after me, but why? Uh you were on death's door just a little while ago, you know. Barely breathing. Just skin and bones. Well the skin and bones part hasn't changed. I mean you are are you even eating properly? Eating? I don't get much to eat now. And not just me, everyone's in the same boat. What? None of your people are eating? What's going on? According to her tale, the place she came from is going through an awful harvest. And not just her village, the same was happening all over that land of Hinomoto. So her entire world was going through turmoil. Even in the royal capital, rice shops were falling into ruin with nothing to eat. What else could they do? So, you see, I was offered as a human sacrifice to beg the gods for help. A human sacrifice? Yes, I would go to the land of the gods and beg them to bestow a bounty upon us. This child's head rough. That's for sure. To think they offer up an ankle biter like this. When I woke up, I was here. So, where are you and, huh? Hey, you aren't a god, are you? Um, what? Me? A god? Well, yeah, you're the first thing I met after becoming a sacrifice. Must mean you're a god, huh? Well, am I right or am I right? 
Now hold on a second. Let me get a, a word in here. That's the first time I'd ever met a human child. And the first time I'd been treated like a god. Oh. Okay, and that one actually did not appear normally like the other things. Oh. That's gonna be a rock one. Hey, Lizzie. So that means I literally need to check every location with the camera, whether or not it says there is something. I'm okay, how are you? There's something here, I can feel it. It's one of those... regular ones. I'm at work, so far it's quiet though. Oh, I didn't want to skip. Oops. Is wanting quiet time to yourself such a crime? No, but it's not easy. How do clouds in the sky look to you? Fluffy and tasty. <laughs> Figures. Let's see if I can make another better move, friend. Nope. She should act on an emotion instead of logic. True to yourself. If your friend was off cause in trouble, how would you deal with it? I protect my friend. Put your heart at ease, don't you think? Gentle soul. I just Agamo look like a little chocobo from that angle. I know you tell me. Someone, please help me. This is only one, though. That's better than nothing. I didn't make the game. 
Neither did I. You're a streamer, you're supposed to know things. I make it my job especially not to know things when it comes to new games that I want to play, Lizzie. You know this. It's only after a little bit that I decide to actually go and look things up. Something should be around here. Don't see anything, really? Did you do something to make yourself see it? Oh, my. I mean, I have my camera. Already did a. Oh, look. I feel like a voice or someone's consciousness in my head. The Tales of the Mural, Chapter 1. I forget how long it has been since the emissary of the Shogun told me. You are hereby ordered to complete the murals for the new shrine. The Shogun himself chose you for this task after hearing of your great skills. Give this your best effort. I happily accepted the commission, of course. Responds with, Sir, it is an honor. Now here I am, thrilled as I walk up to the entrance of the shrine. Finally, I thought my talents are appreciated, personally chosen by the Shogun to create the centerpiece for a new shrine. I'm sure to be seen as Inomoto's chief artist. The thought was enough to make me laugh. What's so funny, you stupid painter? Have you no respect for the shrine? What's this kid? Probably just some bread. Oh, if it isn't the head of the Shogun's personal guard, I'm honored. Very funny. You're the rising star. I heard the Shogun personally chose you for something. That's right, I'll be decorating the walls of a new shrine that's going to be built here with my masterful murals. Mark my words, these works will be spoken of for generations, like the new re reliquary hall of Kitayamate. It was the picture of enthusiasm as I said this, but the boy didn't seem impressed. You mean that hall covered in gold leaf? You think it'll be spoken of for generations? If you ask me, something more subdued would... Hey, got any idea for the subject of these murals? For all that I'd accepted this commission, I had gotten so carried away, I still had no idea what to paint. Thoroughly self-absorbed, I see. As for subjects, are you familiar with the local Kamonogami fate? Nope, what's a Kamonogami? They say people once performed a ritual here that involved sending sacrifices to another world. Then powerful gods appeared from the other world. They call them the Kenamagarmi, and some people still worship them. A pretty typical local faith. Hmm, the Kenamagami. I like the sound of that. Tell me more about these local gods, or point me to someone who can. What a way to ask for help. Anyway, you should talk to the Shrine Maiden. Her job is to pass on the history of this place, so she knows more than anyone. Great, thanks. Yeah, that's why I actually turned off the voice dialogue. <sighs> yes, it's closed. No, we're not gonna sacrifice Aoi. If anyone, we're gonna sacrifice Ryo, the scaredy cat. So I went to meet the Shrine Maiden. She heard me out with composure, then said, You would learn more about the Kenemogami fate. So you would learn more about the Kenemogami fate. Yeah, I got the gist earlier, but I was hoping you could tell me something more striking. <laughs> you are very definition. You are the very definition of rudeness. How amusing! The story she told was long and rambling, but the events were fascinating. It was about a boy sacrificing and his older sister. Long ago, when the world was in chaos, a group of children were sent to another world to save this one. There, in the world of the gods, they gained the power of the Kinemogami and brought peace to humanity or something. 
The Shrine Maiden spoke of this as a great achievement, but it sounded like pointless human sacrifice to me. What's worse, one of those children was a boy's boy sacrificed by his own sister. Did the boy hate her, or for what she did? What was the girl thinking? Anyway, after hearing the story, I got to work. I threw myself into painting the murals, my head full of what I'd hear from the Shrine Maiden and others. I lost track of time completely working until I got tired and decided to go out for a break. Owie is the healer, yo! Jeez, I got a phone call just when I came in. Hi, Sap, how are you doing? I'd been in a dim light of the shrine for so long. Sunlight stung my eyes, then as my eyes adjusted I grew completely astonished. However long I'd been in that shrine, I still remembered what it looked like outside. What is this? Where am I? I cried, starting out, staring out at a completely different world. I'm okay, I'm okay. Buy a new game in a sec. Dive in. What new game? I knew it. There's something weird about this place. You. Yeah, I want to go back to the school. Okay, are you going back then? <laughs> no, no, I was just kidding. Me too. Sorry about that. <laughs> you really get along. Q, Q, Q. Go on, get out of here. Q. Thanks for fighting with us earlier. You saved our bacon. When push comes to shove, anyone would have done the same. And then there was Labramon, who was really strong for us. Hehe. <laughs> He's being modest. Just say thank you. Let's see if this works. Me and Labra, mm, both are amazing together. Lost without you two. Stop, you're embarrassing me. I'm not sure I'd be able to do the same thing again. Don't say that, Aoi. We need to focus on searching for Saki and the others, okay? I should have responded with just. that then. Glad the professor was alright. Yeah. I'm not sure I'd call that alright though. We know that Saki and Shuji are out there. We just need to find them. Yeah, let's show them. Ugh. You okay? The professor's struggling to get up. He's desperate to find Saki and Suji. Leave it to us to find them. You need rest. I'll find them. That's no good. It's my fault that those children were left behind. Do you know where they went? That's... leave it to me. I last saw them. Let's see, I lost sight of Saki and Shuji around here. It was somewhere in this forest. Professor, are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. My memory are still fuzzy. I'm sure it was somewhere close by when we were attacked and separated. Not sensing any enemies at the moment, we should remain... vigilant. Right, if we can't see it, we won't know where it is until it shows us. Normally we can tell when something's nearby, but this creature eludes even our senses. We may be attacked at any moment, stay alert. Let's talk to Minoru. Minoru! Hey, Takuma, aren't those footprints over there? Over there, in the grass. How did you find them? I can see them. I think I can see them. Me too. But it's more of a feeling. Sorry. I saw them through my phone camera. See? It's a bit hard to make out from here, I guess. Maybe try close-up. I can definitely definitely see the footprints on the screen. Try my camera too. It's a kind of magic. 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 Footprints are there. They really are, absolutely. Right. Where are the footprints heading? Into the spider lily forest. Is it just gonna stay there? 
Prince lead into the forest with the spider lilies. Game. Wait, 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 wait. Ah! Let's go try and capture Beomon. We still don't have a Beomon. Christ. <laughs> we might need to do a Corona test tonight. Is that the one and only? Sepa Lepa Ding Dong? Let me work for you as uh, just one. What's more important? What's the most important thing to you? My friends? No. Countless times? Nope. Okay, just be even less happy. Corona is no boy, no. Uh, filled up nose, annoying throat, coughing. <laughs> it is the core of me. What's the most important thing to you? Uh, let's say food. Okay, that's good. Whenever I meet a scary monster, I just start apologizing. Weird, right? I guess it's instinct. Okay, come on, let me recruit the BMO. 73% chance. Yes! Nice. But everyone has their own, uh, what do you call it? Symptoms, right? Not everyone has the same symptoms. The first time I got Corona, it was uh, somewhat the same as this, only then 10 times worse. But I've been having it for a couple of days and I'm like, yo, let's just be safe then sorry that I don't like give my little brother Corona or something when he comes over.
Some of them. We just left the forest and they're headed back in. Might be another attack. What if they die? Damn it. I was wondering what Rio was up to, but he just seems to be really scared. Rio, can you give me a hand? I'm useless. If you need me to be in the way, I'm here. It's dangerous to be alone. Come on, come with me. Come on, Rio. QQ! Shut up! Leave me alone! Oh well, I'll wait until he calms down. Just wanna go home. I miss my mommy. I miss my mommy! virus. That shadow. Do we fight or do we run? We fight. Tough looking mug, aren't you? Bet I'd lose if we threw down. We'd probably die. Fuck, no. Makes me want to yawn. What kind of food do you like? Um, I think you liked that I like meat. Viruses, gay people start dying because of low. What? In the media, they don't tell that monkey hoaxes go through sexual intercourse. I mean, that must be uh, only at your end, though, because they've been yelling it out everywhere where I read about it. Paper every morning, and there was a whole article about it.
I need to make some dinner halfway in between the stream. But I learned something new that I can, like, pause my recording. So that'll make things a lot easier. Sincerity Melon. Here, another one. Spirited away. I continued on through the woods. What's strange? The roads should keep going past here. Shoot. I guess I'll have to head back the way I... But as I turn around... Wait, what? How can this be? The road I came down in... Gone? Is gone? This can't be happening. Even if this is the shrine's forbidden ground, it isn't big enough to get lost in. Damn, how could this happen to me? I was just looking for something to eat. Oh man, okay. I just need to get down the mountain. I'm okay, I'm okay. I can survive on my own. There's nothing to be scared of. Papa went to fight in the war. Mama was in the house when the air raid sent it up in flames. With no one to turn to, I came out to this village in the sticks to be with relatives. My grandparents were cold, cruel even, made me fend for myself. Other adults, children, all the same. They treated me an out they treated me an outsider like they treated an outsider like me with disgust. Damn. Damn their eyes. Why do they have to look at me like that? Papa fights for this land. Mama died protecting our home. And me, I'm doing everything I can. I'll get big and strong, become a soldier like Papa. So why? Why do you treat me like a burden? A shrine lay at the end of my desperate advance. I'd always climbed the mountain on my own. I had nowhere else to go, and hunger crawled at me. The substance of wild vegetables meant I never lacked sustenance. The abundance. And never and even better, no one would no one was around to bother me. The people of the village always said that coming in here would get you spirited away, but that's just an old wives' tale. Fine by me. What do they know? I'll live on my own from now on. I passed through the shrine and into the woods beyond. And here I tried to spur myself on, yet I can't find a path. No matter how far I go, for heaven's sake, am I going to die? Without helping my country? With everyone treating me as a burden? Damn. I can't take it. I don't want to die. Papa? Mama? Hmm. What's this curious sound? I turned at the sound of it. Who? Who's there? Huh? Say, are you one of those human children? Huh? What? The blazes. What is this strange beast? Are... are you a demon? This is why it's good to make extra turns in every fucking thingy. <sighs> New Memoon, let's go try and capture New Memoon. It didn't work last time, but when I tried it was 50%. seemed interested in what the humans are saying. Talk to him slowly. I think that was good. Yeah. The monster looks a bit calmer. You mean me? Monster just stands there. Uh stand silently, make a lot of noise, gesture. Yeah. The monster bends four, scowling at you. Apologetic. No, that wasn't good. I think I did that the last time as well. 41% chance this time. Fs. Double Fs.
have to save them from those beasts, Kenamogami or not. We moved separately, acting as a decoy for the two of them. We're glad you made it out okay. Maybe okay is a stretch. Gochiji sama! Aside from the creatures that attacked me, there was another that tried to save me. Uh, so Falcomon, Akumon, and the others aren't the only helpful ones. Yeah, not all of us are bad. I can't tell if they are good or bad, but I can tell the friendly ones from the hostile. What's he mean, friendly ones? The allies who are nice to everyone. I'm Aoi's friendly one. I'm nice to her. Thanks to them, I was able to escape, but I think they're already... I'm worried about everyone, but not just the professor and the others. Let's hurry on ahead. Whether they're fine or it's too late, we will figure it all out. You're right. I'd be a bad scientist if my decisions were based on my imagination. At any rate, we have to hurry. There are footprints here too. Something's weird. Weird? Look at the camera. Look here and here. The footprints are heading in different directions. Yeah, you're right. But how do we figure out which footprints to follow? I'm betting this is a trap laid by the Kimonogami that attacked us. That thing is clever and tough. Watch out. So one direction is a trap. Talk to everyone. The thing is tough. Watch out. I'm in a room. There are two different print types, though I can't figure out which to follow. I was confused as he looked at the camera. Trust your instincts. It's look the same. We need to trust our instincts. That's it. Leave the instincts to me. I'm always lucky at lotteries. Oh, really? No, I just wanted to say that. Actually, clueless. This isn't the time for fooling around. Just choose one, Takuma. Whichever one you pick is fine. You can do it, Takuma! <laughs> well, that's a lot of pressure. Saki, where are you? Aoi. He seems worried. Encourage her. It's okay, we're going to find them soon. You need to be ready to smile for them. It's time to cheer up. Oh, I'm so glad. I looked at the footprints, but the size and shape are nearly identical. It seems like the only difference is the direction they're headed in. Okay, let me have a look. Are they? There are traces headed back to the spider lily forest. Let's follow them. Aye aye! Here and here and it doesn't point to where we're at. Into the woods by the shrine. Wait, let me look at them again. Those are slightly bigger, I feel. What's by the shrine unlocked? Look out! It's a trap! What the? Whoa, good instincts. You're lucky you noticed me. Ugh, that monster. Hey, leave Takuma alone. Huh. Next time I'll finish you. Seems like the coast is clear. Are you okay, Takuma? Thank you, that was close. I'll probably attack again, we have to be careful.
apologize for involving you all in something so dangerous, but I'm afraid without you, I have little hope of finding Saku and Suji. Saki and Suji. Don't worry, Professor. We've got Agumon and the others to look out for us. Now let's hurry and find those two. Yeah, you're right. Well, what was that thing? If it attacked us, attacks us again, we're all dead meat. Ryo, relax. We have got through it last time, and we'll get through it again. No way. You're fooling us. Next time, we might not be so lucky. We we could all be d d dead before we know it. Q. Didn't I tell you to keep away from me? Ryo seems pretty scared, but as long as he stays with us, we can protect him, right? I couldn't even see that monster when it attacked us before. Is it really going, co going to come after us again? Worry, Aoi. I'll protect you no matter what. Yeah, and don't forget about us. As long as we all work together, I'm sure we'll be fine. Yes. Yes, you're right. I shouldn't let my fears get the better of me. The last fight was pretty bad. I don't know how many more ambush like that I can take. Do not fear, Minoru. However many times we are attacked, I will protect you. Oh yeah, it helps to hear you say that, Falcomon. Now I'm not gonna let it take me by surprise again. Next time we get some payback. Now that's what I'm thinking about, talking about. Suddenly I'm feeling a lot better about this. Thing has changed. Doesn't look like it. Check all the areas. E, my favorite ginger Dutch name, Jordy. E, Thomas, how are you doing today? Oops. place doesn't seem any different from before. I guess that means we didn't show we somehow miss each other. <sighs> That's what you always say, but I'm not convinced that there is nothing here. Until I inspected it. Good lazy day at work, then hits the gym, leveling a bit more on classic WoW now. Nice. There's something here, I can feel it. There's two spots. That shadow. Fight it. There's a chest there. class are you playing, Thomas? Classic. Nice. I played, uh the war look as well when I first started doing classic, but it was such a havoc that I kept getting killed and such that I kinda 
never managed to reach max level in the original um, version of it before uh, Burning Crusade. But looking to play Walk in uh, Wrath of the Lich King. Wrath of the Lich King. <clears throat> How much longer till. Uh, Wrath of the Lich King. Just under two months. <coughs> nice. No. I'm never returning to uh, World of Warcraft. Honestly, for me, it's just time for something new, if it comes to an MMO. That's not new, that's still the same old World of Warcraft, with just some new mechanics in there. Still the same stupid ass endgame.
Last time I saw them was somewhere around here. We've seen this place. We've seen this place before though. Yes, when we first came to the shrine. The shrine is the same, but it's like the same building was built on different land. Well, perhaps not the same, it's like a fake made with similar construction. I knew it, we are in another world after all, who knows? I thought my understanding was... I thought my understanding was of that... the start. Wait, I can't read, apparently. Lotion up my hands were dry because of all the hand sanitizer. Lotion! Look, human footprints. These are smaller than Naoi's. These others are bigger than Takuma's. They're headed that way. My intuition was right all along. I knew you could do, Professor. And if, if I don't know my way around here, I've got my expertise to fall back on. This proves that there are no problems in my sense of direction or awareness. Look, there are some huge footprints around there. It looks like they're chasing after this pair of human footprints. It's not good, friend or foe. It's difficult to tell from the footprints alone. It's hard to explain, but I can get a read on them from their hour on their scent. Some are clever, though, covering up or disguising any trace of themselves. Boy, I guess it takes all kinds, huh? We know something bad is after those two. Either way, we'd better hurry. Indeed, perhaps we should not just look, but listen for clues as well. Yeah, something close. Something's close. You're scaring me. Oh yeah, Professor, you mentioned something before we came to this world. About ritual human sacrifice, right? Nasty story. Still, you think they get something from the Ken Ogami in exchange, right? Ethics change with time. You can't just criticize the way of the past. But as modern individual, the idea of forcing children to sacrifice is appealing. <clears throat> yeah, I agree more. Who the hell cares about that? Human sacrifice could be. You say something? Nothing. Forget about it. At any rate, we should follow those nasty looking prints if we want to find the others. Let's go, everyone. Stay sharp. S you son of a. Did you hear that voice just now? Hey, the bat ones again? That was deep in the forest. It might be Saki and the others. Let's go. Come on! Oh, hey, who's there? Oh, you are... You're an old human dude! Professor, do you know them? It's the child who was attending to me when I awoke. You look much better, hooray! <clears throat> but obviously things are tough here and there. There's too many. Let's check things out first. We don't have time, the kids could be in danger. Let's go and help them out. Yeah, let's go! Ooh, two chests. All Goma Mom are annihilated. Um. Until we're close to them. Big bandage. Is it just me, or did I miss one? Yeah, where the heck is Kunamon? Rock of 
Fist. Oh, that's bad. Electric Stun Blast! Nice miss. Stun, please. Thanks. Marching fishies. Marching fishies. I just realized these guys can attack too. Okay, okay. Um, shit, didn't realize that was a thing. But this chest is harder to break. Turn. And turn. Evolution. Just to make sure that we destroy this chest, or at least open it. Most. Thank you. 
Pepper Breath. Anti Wind Crystal obtained. Okay. You saved us, thank you. But you saved me first, so thanks again. Don't sweat it, seeing those jerks ganging up on a geezer like that, I just couldn't stomach it. Whoa, you're one of the good ones. Yeah, flattery ain't gonna get you anywhere, you hear? Oh yeah, if you're looking for human kids, I saw some by a flat cliff thing nearby. Wait, really? A big one and a small one, yeah? Yes, that's gotta be sucking and sushi. But what do you mean by a flat cliff? I don't know, like a human building or something? Imagine a huge, smooth cliff. But with a ton of water trapped on one side. It's a dam! Wait, was there a dam before? I don't remember one near the shrine, given the current transformed landscape. By the way, have you seen anything shiny at the shrine near here? That would really come in handy, if you say so. Hmm. We could use helpful things. Let's see if we find something along the way. To get to the dam. It should be just ahead, let's go. Anti-Wind Aegis Crystal. Physical defense and special defense. Nice. Inner shrine unlocked. Riverside forest unlocked. Free battle unlocked. Okay, the dam and school areas are now also unlocked. Ugh, no way home yet, I hate this. QQ! What is this? Stay away! Huey! Ah! Well, the fucker is here again. Damn, they noticed. Ugh. You hurt? We're both fine, but some things come in. Whatever, time for some fun. Agumon needs to be in. Survive three Fangmon attacks. <clears throat>
again not good enough. Last coffin. Okay, that's not so good. Um, I don't think I like that very much. And turn, oh, I look towards the wrong direction, stupid. Zero? Oh, it's because of the stupid rock again. Don't you know when to stay down? Next time I'll finish you. Rude. Victory! No experience points, no items. Okay. Annoying. Wait, but... I was... Here, I want... Oh, okay, no, that's just uh, for battle, I guess. Let's go check every location. Mural. That is still the same. Shrine. Oh, Takuma, look! Whoa, what is that? A mature enlightenment slab. <laughs> Amazing, obviously. Finders keepers. means we can actually digivolve one of our free Digimon. Gives bonus SP. You want to go Seedramon route. Evolution Revolution. Infinity is going fairly well with the guys that are here. And my moral is going up decently as well. Can talk to Agumon. Inner Shrine entrance. This is where we first fought with Falcomon. This takes me back. We stay focused, we don't know when the next attack could be. It's fine, we have a clear view of. Minoru, look out! There is the stinky again. Damn it, they noticed. Told you, stay focused, save the ceremony, here it comes, whatever, time for some fun.
can actually kill him. Assist. Fire breath. Now the question is, do we get experience points? Victory! Yeah, we do get experience points. Kaoi? I think so. Whatever. Time for some fun. This is super annoying, by the way. The game teaches you slowly that you should re-explore areas often, and then it does things like this, where you like... <sighs> Get ambushed the entire time. This fucker keeps moving the same way as well. the route we need to take for fastest uh, on defeating him. Victory! Boom shakalaka laka boom shakalaka laka. Did you hear something just now? What? No, not a thing. You must be too wound up, Ryo. Q! Hmm, Kunamon might have found something. Q, Q, Q! There! Damn, they noticed. What is that? Whatever, time for some fun! Seedra, Labra, Kunimun, because Kunimun can't really do much. Move. Turn. Uh, I think I just made a little bit of a mistake. Let's see that in a bit. Not 
too bad. Fire breath. Assist. If I like go every area that he can go and defeat him, if I get a special item. Victory! Inner Shrine had nothing. Spider Lily. Hmm, something's weird. Look, something's staring at us. It's probably that thing. Wait, you mean. Look out! Just a regular attack this time? Okay. Did I actually freeze him? I guess there's a first for everything. Say with a bit of luck, but luck was not on my side. Today. I hope it doesn't repeat this often, because it's kind of annoying. Mature Enlightenment Slab. Hey, we can love uh, Digivolve another guy. Can I just Digivolve you? Apparently it doesn't really need to level up to Digivolve. That's good to know. Uh, let's see, let's go Dokugomon, bro. Get 
inner shrine was free. Look out! Dang, they noticed. There's no time, whatever. Ah! Blast them in the face with Venom Blast. Victory! Ooh, no mature tablet. Is this the same one? No, it's not. Stamina crystal. Oh shit. Okay, that's it. Go to area. Damn. Free battle. Riverside Forest. Is this a river? There are more footprints. They must have come this way. Are there footprints on the other side? They might have used the river to lose the trail. That was clever, but... Maybe they drowned? Kill? No, we have to save them. Yes, we need to find them right away. Hang on. They might have gotten away. We need to find them. I agree with Minoru. I'm a little worried that we haven't found the dam yet. What should we do, Takuma? The, they either drowned, or they found another way, or something else entirely. If there was a risk of drowning, they wouldn't try crossing. They went another way. You're right, they must be okay. But where is the other way? 
Hey you guys, what are you doing here? Gomamon! It's Gomamon! We are following the footprints of the kids we told you about. We got to the river. Well, weren't you headed for the dam? That's right, we couldn't find a way there. That's right, I completely forgot. It's really hard to find. There's only... There's only... Way to the... There's only way to the dam. I'm not... I'm not misreading this, right? <laughs> the kennel's over there. Thank goodness. There's a way. There's indeed, and I'll show you. I owe it to you. Then let's go now. Yes, show us the way. It's this way, follow me. Aqueduct unlocked. Let's go try and capture this minimum. Start the battle. Okay, talk. New memon? Question mark. The monster is staring in fascinated confusion. Take a step forward. I didn't like that. Even more an edge. Monster just stands there. Was gesture the right one? Yeah. Nar. Monster's trying to say something. Give it some food. Okay, let's go. Shit, again. Giant mushroom. The stream. Far does this river go? I wonder if it runs all the way to the sea. Now that we were not that we were all that close to the sea back in our world. Grass. Takuma, I found this! That's amazing, Agumon. Power Pineapple. Oops. Uh, that must mean we got everything here. What's in the shrine? See if we get attacked again. No. Okay. Nothing. Tree trunk. Hey, this could come in handy. Sincerity metal. Melon. Melon. Maybe a bit stupid, but this is the exact reason why I keep going back. Huff huff. Oof. Are you okay? Let's rest for a bit. It's fine. You risk here to stop now. What do you mean? Takuma! Damn, they noticed. This is what I meant. Fine. Time for some fun. Takuna Matatas.
Victory! I really need to go make some food, but I want to do it at the end of this mission. Not here. Should I head to the waterway? No. Lantern. Hey, what's this? A clobber carrot! Okay, the shrine. And then woods by the shrine is probably another ambush. Something's weird. Takuma, I'm here. I won't notice too. It must be that one. Yep. <clears throat> I'm not gonna lie. The areas that we like, the battle areas are kind of annoying. Stay here as well. Agmon. Oh, I can enable auto battles? Settings. Can we speed up? Battle speed times three. done that sooner. Victory! Conduct. Is this the canal? Is this a canal? Oh, look, they're up there. Whoa, it really is a dam. That's the dam then? It's huge! Amazing. There was no canal or dam by the shrine. This is completely unexpected. Yeah, we're headed this way. Let's go. First things first, check the river. If things were quite so bad weren't quite so bad, it'd be fun to play in the river with everyone. Okay, nothing. I can only talk to the professor. That can omo no gami gomamon or certain rank. Saki and Shuji should be over there. We're going to save them, right? And I am not about to put any of you at risk. Come on, let's hurry. Old man, it's not like you can do anything. Whew. Ah. Whew. Yeah. Ooh. 
I can't run anymore, I'm totally exhausted! You've gotta run or it'll get you. The Saki I know isn't this kind of coward. Yeah, you can do it, Saki! There's no way you guys can know me. We just met, didn't we? I know everything about you, Saki. Really? Amazing. This is bad. I'm out of gas, too. Not you, too! Do your best, Suji! I know you can do it! Ugh, sorry, Professor. I think this is as far as we can go. I don't think we can escape. Ahuahaha! <laughs> uh, this is it! We'll never beat that thing. I'm scared! We're all scared. Jeez, you're so useless. Not you too, Lopmon. Fine. I'll take that punk on myself. Don't do it. This creature is much bigger and stronger than the ones we faced so far. If that thing catches us, it'll eat us up. No, no. I don't want to die. So run like your life depends on it. You two, uh... It's okay, Lopmon. Don't be afraid. Now come here. What are you being all nice to Lopmon for? You were just gripping a second ago. First of all, you're teamed up with me, Saki. Well, yeah, okay. Now, come on. Just a little more. We can just get away. No good. It's just too fast. <sighs> Professor! You did your best to save us, but this is as far as we can go. Ugh. Bad ending because we took too long. Why the heck are we getting an exploration now? Damn base unlocked. Waterway entrance unlocked. <sighs> Obviously we're not gonna rush. If they give us exploration time, that is exactly when Yordi does not follow the rules. Okay, nothing here. I take as much time as possible. River still the same. The dam. Aoween. Amazing, there really is a dam here. Can humans make something as big as this? Certainly, but we don't know if this structure here was truly man-made. Oh yeah, talking about I found this over there. Oh, a crisp apple. I don't think I could get m much use out of it. This, so why don't you take it, Takuma? Of course, all of us benefit from you and Agumon building up your strength. Oh come on, now we have a bit more self-confidence. Sorry, Labramon. I don't want you to apologize either. Sorry. You're perfectly capable in your own right, Aoi. You should keep your head held high. Right, I'll try. <laughs> I can tell if you're mad at me or proud of me or what. <laughs> it makes you think I'm mad. It tends to be pretty reserved, but hopefully Labramon can keep her spirits up. Okay. Waterway entrance. That's weird. There's something about this place. Something about this place that will be useful later. Door. The door to the underground waterway has sturdy lock. We can't open it. Is this the entrance to an underground waterway? Doesn't look like we can go in. It is blocked with sand and dirt. No, it's locked, see? It is, just a regular old lock. But with this pattern, it really stands out. What an odd structure. You are certainly well versed in such matters, Minoru. <laughs> I guess you could say that. Still, this place isn't just some parallel world with all these buildings around. Yeah. It's as weird as you say. I wonder if we'll ever solve the mystery. Who knows? Anyway, let me give you this. I picked it up. Ernest Banana. 
Oh, you should keep it. You would take better care of it. Take not... That's not much of a reason. Whoa, now. Oh, just attacks. With gibberish. Wait, attacks? How the heck did that get through? And why is it all messed up? So you got one of those garbled messages too. Two? Me got one too. So like, does that mean we can phone home or... Nope. No good. Can't get a signal. Damn. Well, no use whining about it. Let's worry about that later. Hmm. Surprised there's nothing we can do here, actually. Okay, time to go to the damn! Damn, son! Damn! Whoa, there really is a dam here. I can't believe humans could build something so big. But it, if it, if this isn't from this world, how did something so huge end up here? Who knows, this has been here for as long as I can remember. So like a few years? Then again, seeing Admiral's reaction, it could even be a few days ago. There's nothing there either. Then we just go in? It's possible, where's the entrance? Go in, we better be careful. This area is the den of a really nasty creature called Fang Mong. That jerk has been trying to force us into being its henchmen. Those kids might be in real trouble. We better find them before Fang Mong does. He can hide his presence. But wait, what's that over there? I think I see someone. Yes, it's Saki and Suji. And there's something huge chasing them. Oh no, it's Fang Mong! Oh no, they're in danger! We'll never get there in time! Get its attention or just hurry? Get its attention and buy some time. Hey, fat head! You'll have to get through us! Good, it's looking at us. Everyone, hurry! It worked! Hey, fat head! You're safe! Yes, yeah, same goes for you. I'm happy to see you while not exactly safe yet. Wait right there. We're here to save the day. These Minoru, since when did you grow a pair? More importantly, Saki. These are? Can't say for sure, but they saved us. That's Floramon and Lopmon. You know them? Nope, first time I've ever seen him. Nice to meet you. <laughs> That's so fucking... <laughs> so typical Akumon. Save the introductions for later. Let's handle this first. <sighs> Oh, oh, more prey. Wait, it talks? What the hell? This is no time to just stand there staring. Oh, uh, whoa. Oh no, Saki fell down. Oh, oh, hey. Wait, Suji, I can't believe you left Saki behind. He's full panic mode. Uh oh, more creatures swarming up behind them. Are those Fangman's henchmen? Fangmon. Fangman? Fangman, sure. Fangmon's henchmen? This is bad. They'll pin us in both sides. We can handle these freaks. Right, leave them to us. Oh, Professor. You think you can save Saki alone? That's crazy. Huh. It's okay, Saki. Here, I'll help you up. Come over here. We've got you. Don't worry. Thank you. Rescued. Professor behind you. What the? Don't worry, you say? No, I think you should worry. Wah! Right, we'll take care of these kids. Did he actually got knocked down the fucking dam? What? No way! Oh, -ho. I was after the little one, but my hand slipped. <laughs> Seriously, he fell. Ah, I'm finished. <laughs> what happened? No, no way. The professor fell. Now I'll drop all the rest of you too, one after the other. Oh, can't think. My brain stopped. What's happening? I'm terrified. I'm totally conf confused. Hey now, are you stupid? Why are my legs moving? I'm heading right for the bad guy. What's wrong? You want to be the first one to die? I don't want to die, right? Let's go, Agumon. I'm on it. They're being pushed back. At this rate, they'll all be done for. Huh, that's all you got after all that talk? You're just playing the hero, brat. No, I... 
in the hero? Am I just acting like foolish brat? I want to save them. Oh, we don't listen to that jerk. You're not just faking it. You really are a good person. You really do want to help. La Ramon. The Aoi I know has strong feelings, powerful ones. My feelings? I want to become stronger, but I lack the courage. That's not true. You're standing right here, aren't you? You're fighting right now. Come on, don't you see? La Ramon, you're right. I've got to try. I'll keep moving forward, for everyone's sake. For my own sake. La Ramon digivolves into... The strength of your determination. It's seeping into my whole body. Ah... Huh? Cringe. It's kind of weird that uh, Takuma first needs to say that, and then we go into a cutscene where uh, Aoi is soloing against Fang Mom. I did not anticipate Severus as, as an evolution, though. I think it's Severi Mom, right? Oh, and Dober Mom. <laughs> Aoi, you look different. This is how strong your feelings are, Aoi. That's what gave me this power. I'm proof of your strength. With just heart, you can wield great power. Labramon. Now then, time to teach you some manners. Oh, and Aoi? I'm not Labramon anymore. Call me Dobermon. You, so this is the power of human children. I'll smash it to bits. Uh, let's see. Lopmon and Floramon are in as well. We're obviously gonna use the entire crew. I know we got, like, very good Digimon, but I don't really give a shit. Start the battle. Oh, Numemon over here. But I can't capture these. Fangmon's henchmen approach from below. Look like they're pretty good at a vertical movement. Units with low vert move stats may be hindered from moving to higher places. Keep an eye on the unit's vert move stat whenever you feel like taking low road. Okay, uh, Dobermon. As a Raulon. Okay, I'm gonna send you up north. <clears throat> you up south? Because you were the only one that can literally climb that.
didn't even realize there were chests down there. for a bit while I slowly move. To grab the chests. Pulse actually works. Super range. Attack, destructive war. G seeds. Only three hundred, that is super bad. Talk. Move. DMT boost.
you ultimate black guy and stinky. No, I'm not. I'm nice. I'm not stinky. Here I was like, why was I not getting any... crystal and turn Shit, they were so low level, no wonder they got one shot. Learning Crystal, bonus XP, nice. Skill Crystal. There is some sort of device inside, can this change abilities? Max SP plus one. Don't know. Choice Rib, Mature, Enlightenment, Slap.
You're already on board, so I'm back. I organized things uh, here as much as I could, lol. We did it. It was tough, but we took it down. You guys are amazing. What the heck is going on? There's a lot to explain. But you all... Like I, like you said, a lot to explain. Mon is best friends with him now. We call us friends. That's because you're so mean. Aww. But you're so cute! <laughs> you're much tougher than I thought, damn it. What? After all that, you're still on move? You're still on the move? He's really stubborn. No, we can't afford to give up now. Yeah, and I'll protect Aoi. But you're totally beat. You're still willing to fight for us? We must have reached their limits by now. Don't think we have any strength left. One against so many? Hardly seems fair. Wait, did it run away? We're saved. We survived somehow. Let's rest a little. We need to get somewhere safe, but we should rest for a bit first. We can't even stand. Yeah, it's fine. We're too exhausted. I'm in no state to complain anymore, thanks. Let's rest a little and head back home. But what happened to the professor? Ugh, it's hard to say, and as I hesitate, someone else said it. Hey, look down there! Oh, the fog. Let's get out of here, Takuma. The fog is dangerous. Yeah. It's so thick, just looking at it gives me the shackles. But maybe, just maybe, the fair professor might be still alive, huh? He fell before the fog came in, right? Maybe the fog didn't touch him. I mean, we don't know for a fact that he's dead, right? True, we lack proof. We cannot see even a body from here. Yet, even without the fog, fall from this height. I am bored, D -D -D -D. Can you say kiwi -kiwi for me, Yahweh? Lizzie, I already... Okay, you donated, so I guess I have to. Key queen! Queen queen! Happy? Can't know for sure. I'll go down and look. Minoru, hang on. Don't stop me. No, I'll go with you. I want to make sure. I'll go too. If there's even a chance he's still alive, we have to help him. I'll help too. I can't let you go without me. Let's go first. Hey, I'm going too! Okay, I'll... Let's all search for the professor. There was a canal down there. He might really be okay. Said downstream, he might have been carried away by the flow of the water. He might be able to hear us then, call him out. Professor? Professor! Professor, where are you? Hey, Professor! <coughs> yeah. Wait, who said that? That thing might be nearby. Takuma, I'm still... It's okay, I'm just going to have a look around. I'll be extra careful. 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 He's there, but we've really been roughed up. Yeah, we must have got hurt worse than we thought. Problem is, did that thing just get caught up in the fog? Right, the fog rolled up over its feet, and then it can't move anymore. Even the monsters are affected by the fog. I wonder why the fog is scaring me even more. The more I look at it, I get what Suji is saying. Agumon and the others are backing off. Ryo can't even stand the sight of it. scary, but if we close our eyes, we won't learn anything. We should watch it. We might find some way to deal with it. We just can't... Yeah. What was that? Stay away, don't come any closer. Is that Fangmon freaking out? No, oh, damn it, no! This can't be happening. No! Huh? Ah! The fog, it got Fangmon? It swallowed him up? It was crueler than I thought than I could have imagined. None of us e can even speak. None of us can even speak. Part 3. Okay, we're now officially in part 3. And we're starting off with Mew. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go and start
stop the recording here real quick while I make dinner and I'll be back with the recording once my dinner is done. So, BRB. And we're back. And uh, now we're back. Hopefully. Huh. <clears throat> so, nice dinner. Quick. Easy. Hmm. Tastes nice. Ugh, you're so annoying. Why do you always have to boss me around? Boss you around? I'm just trying to keep you safe. And it's ruining my life. I'm sick of it. Leave me alone. You, this is not the time. Look around, would you? This place is messed up. <laughs> I guess it does seem a little strange. I don't know what happens, but it's been like this since we woke up. As if both of us passing out at once wasn't weird enough to begin with. So I want you to listen to me. You're not going off on your own. Oh my god, stop telling me what to do! You're not the boss of me! Maybe not, but I am your brother and I worry about you. Oh right, I forgot when Big Brother gets worried, he can do whatever he wants. Or not. Besides, you may be worried, but last time I checked, I was fine. Not even a scratch. And you're worried about fainting? Seriously? Never happens. I've now fainted once in my entire life. It's a TV problem. You're being ridiculous. Yeah. And sure, maybe we got lost somehow. But don't you think that's kind of exciting? Exciting? What's wrong with you? <gasps> what was that just now? You think it was an earthquake? <clears throat> no. It keeps happening. It's more like giant footsteps. But they're so loud. Couldn't be another monster, could it? No way, stop trying to scare me. Right, I'm gonna go get a better look. What, Kaito, stop, don't leave me alone! Might have to get closer to the monster, we'll be safer part, I'll be right back. Stay right there, okay? Don't move. Kaito, don't go! Idiot brother. I bet I can get a good view from this tree. I need to at least figure out what's stomping around. I see something moving. What the hell is that thing? Is that what was making all that racket? Its right arm is like a tower of pure muscle. One hit from that thing and I'd be done for. Anyway, now that I know some and dangerous nearby. Time to get back to Miu. Miu, we're in danger. We've got to get out of here now. Miu, what's wrong? Can you hear me? Come on, there's no time for tricks. Miu, answer me. Of course she left, you dingus. <clears throat> Mew? Mew! Morning, Agamon. Morning, Takuma. Hmm, looks like Minoru and the others are still asleep. Wonder if the girls are up. Yeah, I wonder. Wanna go see? Hmm, nah, better not. They'll come to the cafeteria when they're ready anyway. After finding Shuji and Saki yesterday, we managed to make it back here safe. But I was not ready for the conversation that happened next. Well, I'm sure we're all pretty worn out in more ways than one. We should get some rest. Yeah, I can barely stay on my feet. 
Suji, what's wrong? Stay away from me. I'm sorry. Wait, am I missing something? I don't expect all of us to sleep in here, do you? There's plenty of space, what's the problem? Look at all these n nice clean sheets too. I mean, boys and girls in the same room? <laughs> oh, yeah, don't worry about it. We've got way bigger problems than that right now. Are you crazy? How is this something you expect me just not to worry about? <laughs> Money. Girls need privacy. What about when we need to get changed or take a bath? She does have a point. Till now, I've just been doing all that somewhere else. What, so you boys had her go off on her own? That's awful. Show some consideration. Yeah, you tell him, Saki. Roramon, please do not make things worse. You never know when we might get be attacked. We thought it was safe to stick together. Anyway, in the school would be fine. Or is that your deviant little excuse to spy on us while we get changed? Ugh, gross! What, Takuma? No, it's not like that at all. What does she mean, deviant? I don't know, Agumon, it's something that changes from one thing into another. Like a caterpillar that becomes a butterfly, isn't that right, Kunimon? Cuckoo? Whoa, you're both really smart. Sounds like evolving! <laughs> if there's ever anything you want to know, just ask me. No, I believe in this is second thought, never mind. <laughs> Point is, we should have separate rooms. Honestly, I had really thought about it before, but Saki's right. Seems like an obvious thing to me. Ugh, it even matters. We're never getting out of here. Never. I feel like we're being wrongly accused here. Look. What do you think, Takuma? Saki has a point. I feel like we've been rude. I should have said something. Don't blame yourself, Aoi. They're the ones who need to apologize. Really, Saki? It's okay. Yeah, it's not- None- Nobody thought that, okay? <laughs> Stop complaining, girl. Do you, you like cats and lick yourself? As of where the two of you should sleep, Haru, can I ask something? How would everybody feel if the girls slept in the music room with Haru and Miyuki? Miyuki is a girl and Haru is still young. Guess I'd be okay with that. Yeah, me too. Okay, so would it be alright if these two slept in the music room with you? What? But we don't... Giving Haru some kind of look. <sighs> Fine, it's okay, I guess. Great, thanks a bunch. She convinced him she may be the quiet she may be on the quiet side, but she is the older of the two. <clears throat> Alright, now seriously, let's get some rest. Can't say I expected Saki to jump to that conclusion. Give a guy a little credit. Still, could be that she just kicked up a fuss to put on a brave face. We were freaking out about losing everyone. Then ran into the professor, and then look what happened to him. We all agreed to meet in the cafeteria last night, right? Maybe I should head over. Morning, Takuma. Hey, Minoru. Morning. Ryu is so defeated, Shuji as well. Ryo, Shuji, good morning to you two. Doesn't exactly look chipper, but these two seem particularly upset. Not that I blame them after what we saw. Yeah, same here. It's just... it just doesn't seem right. Professor was the only adult here, and he vanished into the mist. Now it's just us kids, and none of us know what to do. But it's no fun if everyone's down in the dumps. Yes, even my jokester of a partner seems rather de despondent. Wish we could cheer them up. No, don't do that. Can't you read the room? The room? How can you read rooms? What? Oh, uh, that's what it means. Uh, help. Now, now, Agumon. Agumon doesn't mean anything by it. 
You guys always like this. Such behavior is typical for Agumon, likewise for Kunamon and myself. Cool. Labramon isn't here right now, but she usually keeps Agumon in line. Oh, okay. Things didn't get so rowdy with us. Professor kept everything going while Flora and Saki would encourage me. As from what I saw yesterday, your partner seems rather unreliable. Even though he's the biggest one? Bigger doesn't always mean better. Besides, he seems rather harsh with Lupmon. It, it's not that bad. Well, all of our partners are young. We cannot expect them to be perfect. It falls to us to protect and support them so they might act properly. I'm going to do this, Professor. Just watch. I'll get everyone out of here. I will. We can't just keep grieving forever. His tears don't exactly help your argument, Shuji. Minoru trying to appreciate what Shuji is going through. Try to appreciate what Shuji is going through. Spend a lot more time with the Professor, so it's a bigger loss for him. Give him time. I mean, I'd like to, but we kind of need Shuji as our leader. After him, the next oldest is Aoi. Well, oh, and Ryo, I guess. Of those three, Shuji is the only real choice. Need to be strong. Snow. Sniff. Yeah, we definitely can't spend all our time grieving. <clears throat> we need to assess the situation. Now, you told me about the school and your supplies. And now I think of it, how did you spend the night, Shuji? Outside. Next that rough. No wonder he's been high strung this whole time. I'd be the same if I spent an entire day running for my life. Alright, let me tell you everything that happened from the beginning. I explained now how we found the school, meaning Agumon and the others. The fight against the spider monster, meaning Haru, Yuki, and more. Yeah, but I'd still say you were the ones playing in hard mode. True. If it hadn't been for the professor, I don't know what might have happened. Just the thought of being hunted down by that terrifying thing, no thanks. What even was that anyway? It kept blabbing on about children and sacrifices. That fits with what the professor had said about the Kamenogami and human sacrifices. Maybe we shouldn't be in the dark like this if we could just ask the guy. Uh, I mean, should probably shut my mouth, huh? Yeah, there's no turning back the clock now. One thing's for sure. There are some weird monsters out there, not to mention that fog. Yeah. The big wolf thing just vanished right into it. I wonder what happens if you get swallowed by the fog. Can't say. One and the others want nothing to do with it, that's for sure. Clearly we'd better watch our step too. When you're right, you're right. What if there's just copies of the school on the mountain way out over these ruins? What if this is all some kind of huge prank? What's a prank? It's the type of joke where you trick people for laughs, especially celebrities. Although I can't see the point of going to all this effort just to prank us. This is another world, it would help explain some things. Like, why hasn't there been any sign of a rescue team, not even a helicopter? It's not like this place is that remote. It has trials, a shrine, and an old school. I don't want to hear this! Suji falls silent after Ryo's outburst, but the implications are clear. We need to think about how we're going to get out of here. Takuma. This isn't getting us anywhere. Shuji's just crying at this point. I'm sorry. Aw. Kyu Kyu! Well, you heard Kunamon. I suggest we reconvene somewhere else. Yeah, and besides, I'm getting hungry. And we should hear what the girls have to say. Those are alright points. We'll need their input before we make any decisions anyway. Yeah, that's true. Let's pick this up again in the cafeteria because I'm starving. Alright, we can talk over breakfast. Come to think of it, I still need to use the bathroom. You guys go on ahead, okay? Why, is something wrong? Just need to use the bathroom, be right there. <laughs> okay, could've just said so. I need to pee, yo! <laughs> We need to take a dump! Well, here comes another big conversation. Sounds like it already started, huh? I can hear Shuji yelling something pretty intense. Do you think something's wrong? I 
telling you, it's a bad idea. We're just kids. Exploring could get us killed. We can't just sit around twiddling our thumbs, huh? We should at least look around. Indeed, fully understanding one situation is essential for survival. I'm with Suji. It's safer in here than it is out there. And I agree with Aoi. Better not to take any chances. SQ, what's up? Right, and I'm not about to put any of you at risk. Professor wanted me to get all of you home safe, and that, that's what I'll do. I don't know how to make it happen yet, but we're all going back together. Suji! That's true. No matter what we do, there's no way of knowing what might happen. Right? And if we're in danger, neither way, either way, why not go out and try and find a way home? You see your point, but you do think... Do you think it's really worth the extra risk? The other thoughts, Rio? Mumble, mumble. He's been like this since yesterday. Thank you. I guess we'll take that as a no then. Uh, Miyuki, Haru, what do you think we should do? I don't know. Don't know. Right then. Oh, Takuma, good timing. Well, so far, opinion has been split down in the middle. What do you What's your take on this, Takuma? Should we scout out the area or stay here and keep a low profile? Like that? Let Takuma have the final say. I don't know. Seems like a big decision. I'm all out for looking around. I think we should explore and see what we can learn. You'd make the right call. But, but what if we get attacked again? We fight back like last time. And what makes you so sure we'll win? Uh, well, I mean, he's got a point. What other option is there? You want to just sit there? Sit here? What's that going to accomplish? Things could change. The monsters might vanish or maybe even leave. Yeah, well, I'd rather take my chances out there than wait around for that to happen. But we can't just head out there with nothing to go on. Be risking death. Hey, now... How long is this going to go on for? I'm bored. No need to be rude, though the conversation doesn't does seem to have reached its impasse. Okay, calm down, you two. Fighting like this isn't going to solve anything. Why don't you both try and cool down for a bit? Yeah, I guess that's fair. Nothing. Nothing. <sighs> yeah, let's do that. All right. So I'll take some time to think of this over again, and we can pick things up when we get together for lunch. How's that sound? Works for me. Ew, let's do that. Now we are agreed. Let's finish breakfast, then stop for a break. Free action! What the fuck? That's the champion. Digimon there. I can go to areas. Forest area. Is there anything fun here? Just a free battle? I'm not gonna talk to... Agumon. I think that's a bad idea. Yeah, Spirited Away Chapter 2. You're already so smart. <clears throat> I somehow lost my way in the mountain while scorching for food. Trapsing through the woods, I was just about to give up when a queer creature appeared before me. Clearly wasn't human, from the looks of it, yet appro it approached me, speaking my language. What? Well, what are you, a demon? Stay away from me! Caves, what's your problem? Stop throwing rocks at me! The demon pathetically defended itself from the stones I threw. Upon closer inspection, it seemed pretty weak. Maybe it isn't a bad monster, so you don't want to eat me? Eat you! Perish the thought! I just want to be your friend. My friend? If a monster suddenly showed up talking about being friends with you, anyone would get scared, wouldn't they? But the strange thing is, I trusted what it said almost immediately. I couldn't put my finger on it, but one thing was clear. This creature was on my side. Oh, right. Sure. I... I want to be your friend too. Honest? Yay! I'm so happy! Say, I'm sorry about throwing the stuff at you. Did I hurt you? I'm pretty tough. No worries. Still, it's nice to know you care. <laughs> Shut up. You've got a mouth on you for a monster. Again, with that monster. 
You've got me pegged wrong, you know. Excuse me? Don't think I fully trust you yet. I'm calling it like I see it. Oh boy. Well, what should I call you anyway? Me? My name is... Just like that, the strange monster joined me for the time. Strange indeed, but it, I didn't mind. It was on my side after all. For now, I'll head back to the village, show off my new friends and prove to that lot who looked down on me just how wrong they are. <laughs> I'm sure all of them will be blown away. Ah, I can hardly wait. That just means I have to get down this mountain that much faster. Hey, AV. I mean, that's uh, SQ for you. He's always dying. There's something here, I can feel it. Mm, what's this? A crisp apple. Jesus, there are many, many, many things here. What's this? A giant mushroom. I didn't read that correctly. Avi said, I'm dying. Avi, how come you're dying? Still the Rona? Because I can't fucking read, guys. You guys are all wrong. Whooper carrots. Umai wa mo shindaryu.
Type skill. Let's give a little more learning crystal and a potency crystal. Especially if it's a weak thing like that. Try and... Nothing. School area. Fight these guys. Lucian, Lucian, SP. Agu, Labra, Falco. <clears throat> Start the battle. Waiting around makes me want to go crazy. You know what you mean. Haha, <laughs> good, good! This is my turf. Leave some food and get out of here. You give me your food. Did you know taking a nap after stuffling your face is just the best? Okay, damn it. Mm, virus. Virus, virus. So, AV, how are you doing?
Serious? This must be a very rare encounter if he doesn't actually attack. Victory! Armstrong keeps saying booby traps. <laughs> it said booby. SQ liking the silly jokes. Okay, let's go. Look in every room first. I'm in a room. What's that guy doing? Stage is same. I talk to Agum. There is a favor in favor of exploring. What do you think of leaving here, Agum? I don't know. It's keeping you from making up your mind. Well, if you want to go explore, I'd want to go too. If you want to stay, I would. So would I. Either way, I'd protect you. <laughs> Not exactly the kind of answer I was looking for. Still, thanks, Agum. Closets. What's this? A power pineapple? What's this? Another power pineapple. Let me have a look at our profiles, right? My moral is 22. Aoi's 24. Rio is 20. I don't know which route I want to go yet. I know that I want to get my affinity with Kaito up as fast as possible because Kaito has a cool Digivolution line. I'm also thinking about IOE affinity up. Um, anything else? You know, we haven't really been properly introduced yet, that's true. Hi, I'm Agumon, nice to meet you, and I'm Takuma. I'm Floramon, Saki's partner, pleased to meet you. Uh, I'm Lopmon, I am Suji's partner, I guess? I take it we're all on the same side then? Uh, of course! Well, I'm more on Saki's side, if she ever leaves, I'm going with her. <laughs> well, you sure don't beat around the bush. She doesn't seem bad, though. She helped protect those two. Naturally, Saki's very special. 
I care a lot about Suji too. Got it. Well, nice to meet both of you. Just like my heart giggles every time you say, oh, there's a chest. That is slightly disappointing, uh, SQ. Chest is not that bad. <clears throat> I just finished some initial drawings on an important commission, only to find myself in a strange new place. What is this? Where am I? Who even am I? No, forget that last one. I'm the world's best painter. Shut up. Stop yelling right next to me when I'm trying to sleep. Huh? Who's that? Turn around to find a strange monster at my feet. Never mind that. Y y you are human, aren't you? That's right. I'm as human as they come. What are you? Some kind of spirit? Haha. <laughs> well, at least you got spunk. I like your attitude. I'm gonna see what you're capable of, boss. Boss, huh? I like that. And if you want to see what I'm made of, look all you want. Though I am <clears throat> in some trouble right now. I'm here to paint the murals for the shrine, but while I was working, everything changed. Can you tell me where the where in Hinomoto this is? Is there a village nearby? I don't know about Hinomoto. There's no village around here. You're the first human I've ever seen, boss. According to the spirits, I seem to have been transported to another world. And if the Shrine Maiden legends are true, no one has ever come back from there from here alive. That means nobody knows anything about this place. Well, that's not good. I'm really in another world? Listen, you don't know a way to get back, do you? I've got a job to do. A way back? I only found out about your world. I only just found out about your world. Well, then this is... A Going to take some doing. If there was no way for me to get back, I'd have to survive in this world. Alright, I've made up my mind. I better keep working on those murals. Hey, boss, what are these murals you keep talking about? You don't know? A mural is a mur mural. Er, uh, how, how can I explain? Actually, I'll just show you. Follow me. Then you'll see what I'm capable of. And the spirits and I went back inside the shrine. There, feast your eyes on my magnificent murals. Though they are not done yet. You said it too so many times in your streams. That's what Twitch has done to Innocent SQ in two and a half years. SQ, a chest is just a chest. There's nothing wrong with saying chest. Whoa, I've never seen anything like these before. I don't know what to say. They're incredible. It's like they're human. There's a human right there. <laughs> it's nice to see you're, th you're so thoroughly impressed. There's no higher compliment you can give it to an artist. I drew these based on legends that I heard about in my world. I knew I'd wind up living out these legends myself. <laughs> oh, so humans know about us too? Anyway... <laughs> Now that I'm here, I can hardly just sit around painting all the time. What's with the grin, boss? Something on your mind? Yeah, this whole world. Ever since I figured out where this was, there's one thing I've just been thrilled about. According, according to the Shrine Maiden, this place is full of gods. Like, they're all over the place. Isn't that great? I can't wait to learn more. Oh, you mean you want to learn about us, boss? You bet I do. There's a whole world out there to explore, full of strange and powerful beings. It's an artist's dream. I'm ready to get out of there and see the world. Let's go, buddy. You got it, boss. Where you lead, I follow. And so, I set out with that spirit-like creature on an incredible artistic journey. Didn't care if we met with good luck or bad, so long as it was fun. I don't know, that word is funny. Okay, so I can only talk to Shuji. Agamon. What's wrong, Takuma? Aren't you going to talk with Shuji and Saki? No. We're not. We're exploring first. 
music room. Where is Miyuki and Haru? Should I talk to them? Should have tried talking to her. First, see if we can find. What's this? A giant mushroom. Okay, let's talk to Aoi. Oh. Oh, Aoi. Takuma? Um, uh, sorry about earlier. No, I shouldn't have gotten so flustered. Sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. It's fine. Besides, given the circumstances, we're all a bit on edge right now. Thank you, Takuma. That's very encouraging. I approve. <laughs> Thanks. Well, now that I've run into Aoi, you might as well get her take on things. Where should I start? Start with this one. How do you feel? I'm scared, worried, and pretty shaken up. Honestly, with the Professor gone, I'm having a hard time staying calm. I know I need to relax more, but. How's our situation? It's hard to know what to make of it. After all, we are just kids with nothing to go on. I think the best thing to do is try and stay safe until help arrives. So what do you think actually is going on right now? Hmm. I'm not really sure. I can't wrap my head around any of this. Sorry, I know that's a bad answer. It's like how I always blank out on tough questions. I know I ought to be able to force myself to think, but that's easier said than done. I mean, it tends to be like your typical honor student, but she can be really indecisive. What's our next move? So what do you think our next move should be? Well, we don't know how long our supplies and clothing will last. For now, I think we should focus on our basic needs. You're always so practical, Aoi. Sometimes it feels like you're a mom. Stop it. I'm just a worry wart, that's all. Talking to you calmed me down a little bit. Thanks, Takuma. No problem. Same here. We should hear everyone's takes on the situation anyway. I wish we could contact someone instead of getting those random jobbled messages. I know it'd be great if we could even get a signal. Let's go talk to these two. Haru. Oh, and Miyuki too. What are you two doing? He's wrapping strings around his finger. This almost seems familiar, but why? That's Cradle. You're right, that's the old game we play with string. Surprised you know how to do it. My sister loves this game. Okay. He says that, but it looks to me like he's playing and Miyuki is just watching. How does it work? I want to play too. You tie a string into a loop and then use your finger to make shapes. But it might be hard with fingers like yours. Aw, oh, man. Our sure seemed relaxed. Has he given any thought to what might happen next? Then again, he's trailed pretty young. Maybe it's best that he plays quietly by himself. So, Miyuki, any thoughts? You know, about whether we should stay in here or look around outside. Does it really matter? Hmm. In here, out there, they'll attack. We'll find nothing. Either way, it's the same. What? You actually answered? Miyuki? 
Mm, she's asleep. That was fast. My sister is tired. You should let her sleep. Uh, yeah, I guess. You should worry about yourself more than me. Oh, yeah. Go and mom, take this. We better head somewhere else, you know, widely. Can I continue talking to her? No. So by the look of it, I can talk to everyone. <sighs> Let's do this free battle and see if we can actually recruit that Digimon. You know, taking a nap after stuff in your face is just the best. Yeah, the best. Okay. Ain't you a frail looking thing? You eating enough meat? You look strong. Huh, not bad. I'll pulverize you. <laughs> Nice, a tough one. Yeah, that is that's it. I know you just what you mean. So what do you want? 44%. Destructive roar. chance to miss actually misses. Electric shock. Funky, the thing that I actually countered. trying. I did this one one or two. Uh, don't remember, it's just one. Okay. Anyone else just gets in my way. Let's 
let's simmer down. <laughs> Not bad. Makes me want to go crazy. I'm pretty sure I know which one is the right one here. Victory! <clears throat> World map. Ooh, Miramon? Eh, fuck it. Let's go to the cafeteria. Professor, what should I do? Should you stop that, would you? All that talking to the professor is driving me crazy. Saki, aren't you sad? Yes, so he was so good to us, and then, then he was gone. That's why I'm telling you to stop, because I can't help thinking about what happened. The professor saved me too. He was very nice to me. And then, when I think about what happened, I... I'm sorry. Man, they're both so sad. Clearly, they're upset about what happened to the professor. Cheer both up. Don't know which one would be the right one. I don't think I'm gonna use either of these in the end team anyways. Let's just go with both. Come on, you two, don't get so down. That's not what the professor would want, is it? You're right, it's not. I mean, I know that, but still. Come on, how long are you two going to mope around? We were just so fired up before. Have you stopped caring about whether we stay here or go exploring? No, wait, don't bring that up. I think I stopped caring? I've been saying we should go explore this whole time. You know I can't allow something like that to enter. I can't believe you! How can you be so stubborn? I'm the oldest one here. It's my responsibility. Well, I'm a lot more concerned about getting home than I am about your responsibility. Oh no, now they're fighting again. You see, this is what I was afraid uh, was going to happen. Well, at least they're both fired up again. So, uh, I take neither of you has changed their minds. That's right, we're going exploring. No, you got it backwards, we're staying right here. We're going! We're staying! 
guess I'll come back again later. Well, that went great. I didn't even get the affinity boost for either one. <clears throat> oh, hey, Minoru. Didn't expect to find you here. You seem down. I think you will find he is merely calm rather than down. Isn't that so, Minoru? Yeah. I just need to clear my head. Everyone is so divided. So I was playing this War Pills game, testing, and got my entire party kills. <laughs> GG. Not that I'm exactly the most cooperative guy myself, really. But you get along with everyone, Minoru. <laughs> the truth is, I've gotten a rotten personality. I get along just to get by, it's not thin to be proud of. I can talk a good game, but that doesn't help much with all these monsters, not at all. Minoru. It's not usually this negative. Maybe it'll help him if I let him talk about what's on his mind. How are you feeling? You don't get the wrong idea, I'm not depressed or anything. Actually pretty excited, can't wait to see what happens next. <clears throat> what do you make of our current situation, Minoru? This all seems like fun to you? Being optimistic, it's true, but we can't act like it's some funeral all the time. That's why I want to be a little upbeat, you know? Yeah, it's not like Minoru's oblivious, but he's trying to stay fired up. As for our situation, here's what I think. We've been thrown into another dimension. At first, I thought we might be in the future, but that doesn't make any sense. And this isn't some movie set either we're talking about if we talked about that. It's probably the least realistic answer, but it might just be the truth. So think about it. We, If we accept that this is what happened, how do we get here? How did we get here? And since we made it here somehow, there's gotta be a way back, right? Yeah, you're right. That makes a lot of sense. Good thinking, Minoru. Very cool and level-headed of you. Amazing, Minoru. I know, right? And then there's this screwed up message. I bet it's the key to getting out of here. It's all this nonsense. I, what's all this nonsense? I don't know. You sure about that? Hey, I'm just saying it might be a clue or something. Gotta turn over every stone. Anyway, yeah, we shouldn't give up just yet. I guess not. You sure? Something else, Minoru. Minoru. What's our next move? So, what do you think our next move should be? Adventure, of course. Let's go adventuring. You've got monster partners backing us up. We ought to get out of there and explore this place. There's no point in just sitting around. That's quite the approach. Uh, Alright. <clears throat> I'll totally make it big someday. Minoru's kidding around, but I can still hear the tremble in his voice. <clears throat> so what do you think actually going on right now? Hmm. Beats me. Kinda feels like we're in some kind of weird sci-fi story though. Definitely the sort of thing you'd only expect to see in fiction. But there's no crying about it, right? Might as well enjoy it. You could live your whole life and never see anything like this, and it's happening now. You sure have an interesting way of looking at things. Sci-fiction? Sci-fi? Fiction? Nani? What are those? Apparently when Quest is labeled as hard, it's fucking hard. I want to try out the boss fight though. Lol. I am, I too am uncertain, but from how Minoru speaks of them, they must be enjoyable. Then I bet I'd like them. <laughs> Finty with Minoru went up. So, that's what I've been thinking. Was it any help? It was big help, thanks. Of course, we'll need to get everyone's opinion before we settle anything. Yeah, I know. Good luck thinking up something that'll get us all on the same page. <clears throat> Get us all on the same page, huh? Minoru can seem thoughtless, but he really does care.
Amulet's Acorn. That's Shadow. Oh, let's fight it. It just instantly engaged with us for some reason. Testing an Iron Man isn't necessarily too safe. I think music is tad too loud. What music? Turn it lower because then there is no sound at all.
Victorine. One more carrot. Lizzie. What's up? There's something here, I can feel it. Love is in the air. That's Shadow. We're not fighting the Shadow. What did I miss? Not much. Just a bunch of fighting and a bunch of angry dipshits. Ooh, Patamon. I'm gonna try and capture this Patamon. No. I did not go and have dessert. Why are leaves green? Or yellow or red. Didn't like that. It's good to have goals. Okay. Whenever I meet a scary monster, I just start apologizing. Weird, right? It's kind of desserts. No, it's not. Why are leaves green? To make people calm. Okay. I don't care how tough you are. I'm not gonna lose. Nice. So enter. Someday I'm gonna run this joint. Not a chance. Dessert doesn't have to be sweet, you know. Just saying. saves time for just resetting the fight. Go see if anything changed in the cafeteria. And Sake, I wonder if she got the news to this place. Sucky, sucky, sucky. Sucky, sucky, sucky. Minora Naoi. Maybe I should talk to them. 
<laughs> Ow. I'm stiff as plank, yo. My brain was like, let's grab chips and crunch that into my milk. Ooh. That's why I was getting worried. She was right here and then just a minute ago. She couldn't have gone far. Right, I bet you'll find her in no time. Anyway, I'm sure you don't have to worry. Lovermoon's a lot tougher than you or me. I guess that's true. Thank you, Takuma. Agumon. Uh, Falkmon, where Minoru, what's wrong? You were together just a second ago, but now Falcomon's gone. Where'd he go? To the bathroom? You might run off without saying anything, but Falcomon wouldn't let you know, right? He sure would. Still, this Falcomon we're talking about, I'm not worried. So, Agumon, what do you think about Falcomon and Labramon going missing? you have any idea where they might have gone or where they left? Hmm, I don't know. But I don't think we should be worried, really. They're always with Minoru or Aoi. Doesn't it bother you that they're gone? Not really, I kind of feel like they're just over there. Not that I know or anything. I ask a question, you don't know the answer, same as always. Still, when you don't know, you don't know. Not much else to say, right? True. Falcomon never was stolen. He is a fraud. You know who the real fraud is? Oh, it's Saki. I wonder if she's gonna use this place. Let's go talk to Saki. Oh, Takuma, come here, would you? I could use someone else's opinion. Hey, what about me? Oh, right, sorry. It's funny, though. Talking with you feels like talking to myself for a moment. It's weird. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? I don't mind joining you, but are you sure you don't want someone else? I'd take anyone at this point. <laughs> How dare you? That's Yordi's favorite. No, it's not. Agumon is my favorite. Oh, no, actually, Vimon is my favorite. But after that comes Agumon. Maybe you can tell, but I get lonely pretty easily. I feel like a lot of girls are like that. I get lonely easily too, does that mean I'm a girl? No, you don't seem much like a girl to me, Agumon. Still, Aoi told me she likes reading by herself, so maybe she doesn't get lonely? Speaking of lonely, how did Haru and Miyuki survive here all alone for so long? It's weird, because even if it's a little different, sitting here in the cafeteria, Eating lunch like this, it makes me feel like it's all been a bad dream. Wouldn't that be nice? And the professor wouldn't have. Seems like Saki's still upset about the professor. Maybe I'd better leave her alone. Hey, talk to me about something, would you? Huh? That'll uh, help my mind off things. Hmm, okay. I uh, guess if she wants to talk, we should. Right! Let's 
So how does all of this make you feel? I don't know. So much crazy stuff has happened, I feel like I'm about to explode. To be honest, this is all way too much for me to deal with. Really not sure how to react. The best I can do is just not think about it at all. If I'm sad, I'll cry. If I'm scared, I'll scream. That's good enough for me. Ah, uh, sure. Certainly understand how Saki feels. We're all basically in the same boat, myself included. If I let myself dwell on things, I'd be frozen with terror. So I hope I hold to home to hope. You need to keep pushing forward, otherwise I might end up like Rio. Um, did I lose you? Oh, sorry. There is a lot on my mind. I get it. Honestly, if it weren't, if I weren't careful, I think I'd go to pieces. We should like do Kickstarter for every JRPG game project to give them money to do voiceovers. I mean, there is a voiceover in this game, Sep. Only it's Japanese. You heard him when he goes quack quack. Got that? How's our situation? I don't really know about our current situation, but here's my take. Remember what Mew said about the curse when we first met? Yeah. I think that was true. You think so? Pretty sure never we've never seen before. Strange jumbling messages. Sounds like curse me. In one of those messages too, huh? They're kind of creepy, aren't they? At least everyone here, if it were just me, well, I'd tear up just thinking about it. So what do you think actually is going on right now? How should I know? Yeah, I hear you on that one. Whatever happens is gonna happen. What matters is how we act when it happens, right? Fairly level-headed of your, uh, Saki. So what do you think our next move should be? I really don't know. Pass, I'll leave the thinking to you and Aoi. Me? Why me? What do you mean? Don't you usually make the final call? Uh, do I? Maybe you're right. Well, thanks for sharing your thoughts. It was helpful. Good. It helped take my mind of things too. Thanks, Takuma. Alright. Better get going. Sure thing. Good luck. Make sure you take the time to talk to everyone. Will do. See you later. Wait, where the fuck did everyone go all of a sudden? Looks like no one's here. Does your sandwich taste good? That shadow. Run. It's ham and salami. Shlammy, big chungus whammy. It's a kind of magic, magic, magic.
Looks like no one's here. Someone is happy. Looks like no one's here. Big bandage! Feels like I'm missing out on one of the... Where's its re re perceived memories? Wait a sec, is this game only five chapters long? No, because we're in part three now. Never mind, so I, I brain... Brain not work. Small PP. I mean, what? Hey, Takuma, have you seen Pokemon anywhere? No, I haven't. Don't tell me he's been gone this whole time. That's right, at first I figured he'd be right back, so I wasn't too worried, but now that he's been gone so long, I'm starting to think maybe something has happened. Hmm, that's weird. I seem to have lost track of Agumon too. Yeah, I don't see him anywhere. And you don't know where he went? Beats me. Uh, knowing Agumon though, I doubt he'd go far. Right, maybe you just need to wait for Falcon to come back. He says that, but I can tell he's still worried about him. At least he's not crazy enough to go out looking for him on the moment without Pokemon. I don't know would definitely get lost out there still. She could reassure him. Well, I'll be sure to keep an eye out. I'm going all around school anyway. That's great, thanks man. Oh, but don't let it distract you from talking to everybody. Besides, you never know, he might come back on his own. Right. You know, I'll keep waiting for a little while longer. Cool. I'll be sure to send him your way if I see him. Great. <coughs> Which is weird because everyone is suddenly poofed, gone. Oh, here. Kunemon is suddenly alone. Oh, the forest area has snow. Wait, what the fuck? Slopemon, but she's just nowhere to be seen. Uh, Slopemon? What are you doing here? Are you by yourself? Yeah. Where's Shuji? I tried calling for him, but he won't answer me. It's like you've gotten trouble of your own. You know, Akumon's been missing for a while now, too. Where did everyone go? Takuma? How do you feel about us? Hmm. You mean about you, Agumon, and the others? Right. Strange creatures. You all seem like strange creatures, I guess. I'm not sure how else to put it. <laughs> yeah, I think you humans are strange too. That may be too blunt. Still, it's the only accurate way to describe how I feel. Lopon is concerned about your relationship with Shugi. Know that, but. There's no way I could know what to say that would help them. All I can do is say how I feel. Lopon doesn't seem satisfied. But what else is there to say? Um, anyway, I'm gonna keep looking for Agumon. Cheer up, Lopmon. 
Sure. Bye. Poor Lopmum. Lopmum is all sad. Kunimon? What is he doing? I wonder. We're gonna get into Lizzie's favorite part right now. Where I'm just gonna be uh, doing Kiku, Kunimon. What are you doing by yourself? Where's Ryo? QQ. No, sorry. I still can't tell what you're saying. Wait. I think I can guess though. Ryo must still be in bad shape, huh? Is that why you decided to go out for a walk? Man, if only there was some way for us to communicate. I know, why don't you try using gestures? Thank you? Haha, <laughs> yeah. The way you're tilting your head like that, I can totally understand. And I put this, why don't you try using movement to show me what you're thinking? QQ! There, that's a knot. This might just work. You leave Rio. Are you sure it's safe to leave Rio? I know he's rough shape, but should he be alone? Q. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not blaming you. No need to look upset. After all, the others are in school too. So it's a lot safer in there than outside. I'm sure there are times you'd like to be alone. It reminds me, some of the others are missing too. Have you seen Agumon? Hey, Kudumon. Have you seen Agumon or any other missing person? We're looking for them. Cool. What? Doesn't that go to the shrine? You mean that's where they all went? Cool. But why? What's there to do with the shrine? Why are you here? What brings you here, Kudumon? Cool, cool. The heck? A circle? Something big. Some kind of outline. Hmm, sorry, I don't get it. Where are you going? Is there something you want to do here? Or are you heading somewhere else? You. Oh, he's pointing. That's easy enough to get. Let's see. The shrine. Why do you want to go there? You, Q. Hmm, what's he doing now? Shaking his head, staying alert, looking for something. Mm, sorry, I don't get it. QQ. Uh, what? Are you saying I should follow you? I don't know. I feel like going into the forest without Agumon would be dangerous. But if that's where Agumon and the others are, I would like to go bring them back. Right, that settles it. Take me to Agumon and the others. Kuike! I can't believe this is where everybody went. Hey, Agumon, where are you going? I'm not going anywhere. Look, there's something here. Hey, what are you all doing? Oh, Takuma, this way. Why are you all out here? I just got this feeling like something was there. Something like what? Hmm, be on your guard, everyone. There's definitely something there. What? Well, what is it? I can smell something. We have to be careful. You know what it is? No, I'm telling you to be careful because I don't know, you moron! <laughs> Whatever it is, it's certainly a creature like us. But we can't say it's friend or foe. See, look over there, something rustling through the bush. Wait, don't get any closer, it could be dangerous. Let's watch from here. Suspicious thicket. Look, look, Takuma, there's something there. Whoa! Something just jumped out. It's Gomamon! It's with that thing. Are you sure it's not going to attack? It appears wary of our presence. Look, it's hurt. Maybe that's why it's upset. It's been glaring at us this whole time. What should we do, Takuma? Shouldn't we treat his wound? That's probably why it's so agitated. You're so kind, Takuma. You sound just like Aoi. 
Are you sure? The creature is wounded. It might fight back. It looks scared of us. Maybe it's the injury. I'm sure it'll... We'll see we need no harm if we take slow and steady. Gomamon joined the party. That's random. Just a random Gomamon that just suddenly decides to join. <sighs> I'm really taking it slow and steady with this game. I just realized that I should probably have checked for some hidden items there. It's almost lunchtime. Better get back to... Takuma! Takuma, you're back. Takuma, this is huge! You won't believe it. I won't believe what? It's really big and shiny and just unbelievable big and shiny. What are you talking about? Uh, what was it Falcon called it? Oh, right! A radio! Tawa! A what? Oh, you mean a radio tower? I quickly got everyone together and they were thrilled by Agumon's discovery. The radio sent cell signals too, right? If we go there, our phones might start working. And I bet from a tall building like that, we could get a great view of our surroundings. Just how tall is it? It's super tall! Oh, well, you saw it too, right? How tall would you say it was? Well, it's hard to say with no comparison, but it was taller than this school. If it's that big, then there's no doubt. You think it's working? That I do not know. After all, none of us have ever heard of these towers before. Well... If we went there, we could find out. Who knows? Maybe there's someone there. Yeah, sitting around talking about it isn't going to do as much good. Then it sounds like we're in for a hike. Let's do this, Aoi. A hike? What do you mean? What kind of hike? Oh, didn't you know? The tower is on top of a mountain. Through the forest and over a mountain pass. Wait, you mean we need to go through the forest? You can't be serious. This place is crawling with monsters. Just exploring around here would be risky. But if you want to climb a mountain, there's no way. We should stay here. Shuji, don't have to get so upset. Shut up! I don't want to hear another word from you. Uh, poor little mom. Doesn't matter. Nothing we do matters. Ew. Say what you want, Shuji, but nothing's going to change if you just stay here. A bunch of kids. What can a bunch of kids do? We need to wait for the adults to come rescue us. As if anyone's coming. Neither. Yeah, Shuji, you said it yourself, nobody's coming for us. Or said that, not out loud. If I did, that might make it come true. Even knowing there wasn't much of a chance to rescue, none really. Should you still hope? I'm, I'm going with you. Labramon, will you come with me? You bet I will, Aoi. Wait, Aoi, I thought you agreed we should stay here. If, if the tower has cell signal, that would mean we could contact the teacher. We could talk to everybody, even call for help. Call for help? Yes, and then wait to be rescued. Are you really against this, Shuji? You tell him, Aoi, and hey, that means now a majority of us want to go explore. Just in this tower too. That puts me, Minoru, Saki, and Aoi in the favor of going. So what now, Shuji? But, no. I must really not want to go back out there if he... still not convinced. Only there were some way to win him over. Is it 
far from here to the tower. Uh, might be a bit of a walk. It's not far. We could explore the area and be back before setting down. Well, there you have it. I don't think we need to worry about getting lost. Yeah, I guess not. Well, if you all want to go, I guess there's no point in me trying to stop you. Okay, everybody. Bye. Bye. What are you two talking about? You're coming with us. What we do with monster attacks and it's just the two of you? Let's not forget, neither of you have a partner monster. Indeed. We, st we will not let any harm come to you. And I'll keep you safe too. Never one to be left out, are you? Yeah, Agumon's like this all the time. Ario, you'll look after the place while we're gone, won't you? Wait, don't you go leaving me behind? I'm going too, okay? Oh, come on, Ryo. <clears throat> How's your... How are you so uncooperative if you can't handle being on your own? No, oh, it's alright. At least he's still... At least he's finally back to being Ryo, we know. He's been a little off lately, but the guy is supposed to be bitter and crabby. Following directions from Agumon and the others, we emerge onto a, path, a mountain path. Hard to believe this place was right here, so close to the school. Yeah, it's just a little to the left of the shrine, and yet it feels so different. We're a big group and Haru's a little kid, but we still made it in under an hour. This drop goes really far down. It's not too steep, but it would still be a nasty fall. Hey look, there's a huge bridge over there! Whoa, that's enormous. I've never seen anything like it before. this again. Can you give it a rest? Oh, what do you mean? Give what a rest? Agumon keeps talking about how he wants to be like all this stuff he sees. Yep, I want to be super big just like that bridge. See what I mean? You guys are funny like that. Do you think it's weird, Takuma? Yeah, though I hard it's hardly the only strange thing about them. He got me there. The fun fact that they even exist is pretty strange. Hehe, <laughs> you're too kind. That wasn't a compliment! I've been having so much fun with Floramon and the others that it's easy to forget. But we still don't really have any idea what they are. Yeah, that's kind of the question I wish the professor were here to answer. Not that I can say that in front of Saki. Are you alright, Ryo? If if we get attacked here this time, this time I'm the the. It's okay, I don't sense anything dangerous nearby. Oh, shut up! Leave me alone! You... Like, you even care what happens to me. Just go and leave me alone. It's not going to happen. We're not leaving anyone behind.
root. That's what the professor wanted, so I, I own that too. Yeah, I feel the same way. I'm not about to just leave you alone. I don't want to lose another person the way we lost the professor. Damn it. Just shut up. Now he's back to mumbling under his breath again. At least he's keeping pace. Hopefully that's a good sign. We've covered quite the distance. The tower's on top of this mountain, right? It sure is. Hmm? Look, there's someone over there. Is that...? It's Kaido! It is? What a relief. I'm so glad he's okay. Wait, there's someone with him. Who could that be? You, what did you do with Mew? And you better give me a straight answer or you're not gonna like what happens next. <sighs> when will you get it through your skull that I don't have to tell you anything? Why you little- Fine, you asked for this. Kaido! Kaido! Huh? Mm -hmm. You're alright, it's good to see you. Guys, help me out. This lady- Oh, we know who this is already. There's only one- Digimon. That could be this typical, typical, typical shenanigans again. Please, huh? This boy came out of nowhere and started screaming at me. I don't know why. Stop lying. I know you're a monster in disguise. Kaido, stop. What's going on? Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Drakmon, Kaido's partner. I'm Akumon, Takuma's partner. And I'm Takuma. Nice to meet you. Pleasure's all mine. Now, I better explain why things are so messed up. Kaito and Mew were going through the forest together, then Kaito went to scout ahead. He came back and Mew was gone, so he started looking for her, and this is where I come in. Well enough to help right away, so I knew he must be alright. It was kind of a snap judgement, although I guess it worked out this time. Anyway, I started helping Kaito, looking for Mew, and then that human woman showed up. You can't really sense her like you can the rest of us. True. But some of us can mask our presence, so I'm not sure you can go by that. So, what are you going by? Instinct. And I trust Kaido, which means I trust his instinct too. But is that really good enough? What if you're wrong? Then we can just apologize. Well, I guess that's one way to look at it. You know, the fucking yellow hair... The red outfit, I bet she is, uh, what is that fucking female spider Digimon called again? What do you make of that woman? Why do you think she's arguing with Kaido? I have no idea. We'll just have to find out. You should start by hearing out what they have to say. Good thinking, Aoi. <clears throat> That's just what we should do. Talk to everyone, obviously. You make it that woman. Why do you think she's arguing with Kaido? No idea. We'll just have to find out. Yes, asking about that sounds like a good place to start. Takuma, do you think you can handle this? Me? I'll go with you, of course. But I think you're the best one for the job. Can I count on you to take care of this? Okay, I'll do what I can. Good, good luck. Rio. She, she looks just like her. Who is she? What's Kaido is complaining about? No idea. Just have to find out. Really? Not that I care. 
Cool. What do you make of that woman? Why do you think she's arguing with- They are literally all saying the same thing! Yeah, sounds about right. Well, ready to get to it, Takuma? <laughs> You're coming too, right? You're not just putting this all on me, are you? <laughs> no way! Sounds like a huge pain to me. Count me out. Hey, no fair! It's not... If you're not going, then neither am I. Both of you come give me a hand. What do you make of that woman? Why do you think she... Literally! Why? I have no idea. We'll just have to find out. I think so. Good luck, Takuma. What? You're just leaving this to me? Yeah, man, I can't talk to someone that pretty. Makes me super nervous. Minoru, you... When you speak so casually, it just makes it obvious that you're being insincere. I'm doing it on purpose, okay? <laughs> Iron Bridge. Are any of you concerned about Kaito and that woman fighting? Nah. Nah. <laughs> hey, Kaito's a friend. I think you should at least be a little concerned. I keep talking about Kaido. Who is he? Uh, we've never met him. Never. What? Oh, right. You never did meet him. Is he really a friend? You're sure he's not some not a monster? Don't worry. He's definitely a friend. Just uh, very worried about his little sister. His woman just showed up and started talking to me, and she was holding Mew's purse. What about Mew? You're right. I don't see her anywhere. Where is she? I don't know, we stayed together for a while, then I left for one second and she was gone. It's awful. And this woman comes out of nowhere with Mew stuff. It does seem suspicious, but why call her a monster in disguise? Everything we've met so far has been a monster. What makes you think she's not? I'm not sure that's logical. You see, he's convinced. And I don't know what to do. I mean, look at her fucking yellow-ass eyes. That's not natural. Only spoke to him because he's the only soul I saw nearby. Well, what say you? Don't tell me you're buying that bull. Hmm. I was out walking not far from my house, and suddenly I was surrounded by a strange fog, and the next thing I knew, I was lost. Just lost. I was somewhere I'd never seen before. I kept walking until I saw this boy. As for this purse, I was... It was lying by the path I was going to return it if I found the owner. Nothing about that sounds off to me. Me neither. She even has me use purses off. Kaito, relax. Would you please stay quiet for her just a minute? One thing that does seem strange to me is her ability to be safe without a monster. What do you mean, monster? What are you calling a monster? Oh my, look at that fucking face! Ah, what could that be? That seems more like an act than an actual surprise, but maybe I'm overthinking it. Uh, <laughs> hmm? What is it, Rio? Mommy? Uh, excuse me? Oh, she just reminds me of my mother. She's a good person, I'm sure of it. Right. Gaito and that woman are saying completely different things. What story do we trust? I think we should hear more from Kaido. Good thinking, Aoi. It's just what we should do. Drinks neither, drinks milk. Yeah, I already answered that. Is that all you know how to say now? So what makes you say that? Right now, it's just my intuition. I'm more inclined to trust Kaido since he's a friend. And that's that. Uh, that's and that one story seems a little too convenient. Saki. Kaito and that woman are saying completely different things. Whose story do we trust? Hmm. Why don't we ask about the woman's story? You suggest that? Just a feeling, you know? Besides, it's not like there were any holes in her story. More importantly, I can't stand how Kaito just refused to listen. 
he keeps going on and on and on and not trusting her, it's like he's got tunnel vision. He's got tunnel vision. But I wasn't here. Well, they, pff, that's not my problem. This funny face you're making, Saki, it's all scrunched up. Come on, don't look at me when I get like this. Well, I do see what you're saying. Doubting her is because she had some new stuff seems kind of, you know, real flimsy. Heather, are you sure you aren't jumping to conclusions? What about what she has to say? Oh, come on, guys. Takuma, you must be able to see that something's not quite right here. Well, I don't think we know enough yet to say that for sure. Wait, hold on a minute. Didn't the professor say only children get offered as sacrifices? And if so, doesn't that make it strange for there to be an adult here? Hmm. Yeah, you're right. I'm not so sure. I mean, sacrifice might not have anything to do with this. Besides, the professor was brought here as an adult. Maybe it's not that strange. You're right. Who cares about some random disappearances? She did something to Mew! It's getting old. Would you give it a rest? Totally suspicious. Don't you trust her? Hmm. How can I clear things up with you for you? I believe you. <laughs> well then, thank you. Yes, mommy. Kaito, if you don't trust her, what's the alternative? Could you lay it out for us? Don't give me that. If you screw with me, I will mess you up. Quit snapping at people. See, this is the problem with you, Kaito. You refuse to budge and just harass people until you get your way. I want to hear this. This isn't about my problems, okay? Please stop fighting. Kaito and that woman are saying completely different things. Whose story do we trust? Well, if you ask me, we should talk more with that woman. Why is that? I mean, just look at her. Man, she even smells nice. That's why you end up becoming a prey, Minoru. Haha, <laughs> Minoru, you look funny. Your whole face is red. Minoru, be serious. Yeah, I'm serious. It's not like I'm deciding based on looks because I'm so confused. Right, okay. I think I see where you're coming from. Kaito and the woman are saying completely different things. Whose story do we trust? In my opinion, we should hear a bit more from Kaido. Why do you say that? When I realize we don't have enough information to really come to a decision. But I like to say... But like I said before, that woman being alone out here seems weird to me. You think it's weird that she could survive in this world of monsters all on her own? Exactly. Every few hours there's a crisis. How can she be so calm out here by herself? If it were me on my own, I'd have lost it by now. Shuji. <laughs> you monster, what did you do with me? I keep, I keep trying to tell you, I don't know. Cut the crap, admit it, you kidnapped her, didn't you? Uh, please don't hurt me. Stop, what's wrong with you? There's no need to resort to violence. Let me stop Kaido. Right. Let go of me. She took her. She took Mew. Even if she didn't, she knows something. Enough. You need to calm down. Kaido, there's no need to hurt anyone. Relax. I'll stop. Let go of me. Ooh, what a relief. Everybody chatting nice and all, but how much time have you got spared? Yeah, we really should stop getting to the tower. Start. We sh really should be getting to the tower, but what about Kaido? We've got to find Mew, so come on, let's get this over with. You relax, you don't have to get so worked up over every little thing. What an incorrible brute. You said it. So, what do we do? I mean, either we believe Kaido or this woman, right? She's right, mommy's right. QQ? To be honest, I'm not sure how much I trust her. But if she knows the way to the tower, it'd be great if she could show us. 
a good point. Regardless of who we believe, we have to keep our goals in mind. It'd be great to have guys, after all, I'd hate to get lost out here. And Agumon years already make it up there. What? Oh, I don't know the way. What? You don't? I apologize. I misled you, but we only saw the tower from far. We could have gone lost at all. We time. That just makes us even better. And now we can have her show us the way. Yes, let's do that. You sure don't have to get lost. You actually want to trust this liar? There's, that's the monster that could no, you. I'm telling you, you've got it all wrong. Great, here we go again. Takuma, I think it's time we made a decision, right? No one knows the way to the tower, but she does seem kind of suspicious. Kaido's a friend, but he's not making much sense. And he's, he seems pretty hung up about me. Honestly, I'm going with Kaido. I don't trust the woman whatsoever. I knew, even if that means I have to do it alone. Wait, didn't I? So long then. Wait, didn't I? <sighs> Man, I wish I hadn't been so stubborn. I'll go reason with him. You guys go on ahead. Takuma, not you two. Don't you walk off like that. You can get to the tower just fine without Agumon and me. But it might take a while to talk some sets into Kaido. So meanwhile, check things out. Didn't I... Didn't I... Say... I trust Kaido? Uh, what time is it? It's Auto. Should I believe Kaido? But nobody else believes Kaido. Okay, so that's. Harumiki? Man, if I don't hurry, I'm going to lose Kaido. I can't stop to argue about this. Fine, but stay with me, okay? Let's go, Agumon. Hey there, we meet again. What's up? Huh? What are you doing coming after me? Don't give me that. Why do you always have to act on your own? Hey, you're the one who followed me. What do you call that? Not letting a friend go off on his own. One I wasn't sure I'd ever see again. Is that so? Now what about the halfpins? Are they your backup? Halfpins? Alright. You haven't met these two yet. This is Haru, and this is Miyuki. We've been sticking together. Hi. Hi. Sure, whatever. Just remember, you're the one who wanted to follow me. You'd better not slow me down. Drakmon joined the party. Oh no, children.
Sagama, what do you make of that woman we met earlier? Hmm, I'm not so sure. Okay, I mean, she seems suspicious, but I'd hate to doubt her without any reason. Yeah? You sure are nice, Takuma. Nah, that's not called being nice, Takuma. That's called being indecisive. Which is pretty harsh. Look, Takuma, I want you to remember this. If something important to you is on the line, don't think, act. Because once it's gone, whatever you do, it'll be too late. Right, I'll keep that in mind. Suspicious. Oh, crap. Yeah, I found something. It's not something weird, is it? Like monster droppings? Gross, gross. It's not monster droppings, come on! <laughs> what is it then? Guard break. It's gotta be good for something. We need to use everything we can to survive. That's true. Good job finding it, Agumon. Hehe. <laughs> well, that was not necessarily what I wanted to do, but. Wait, can I go back? Shit. Oh, it's an actual cable car. What a curious device. It looks every bit as run down and decrypted as that school. Does this thing actually work? Cars run automatically on schedule. One should be here soon. Wait, you mean there's a university here? Wasn't any at school. I bet it's some kind of wired power source, not so far fetched compared to our little pals. So this thing runs automatically? Are you sure it won't drop us halfway to the top? What? There's no way I'm getting on that thing. Yeah, fall from that high and even I'd be done for. We, we could fall? That would be terrible! We'd better not ride that thing. Don't worry, the car and the cables are both quite sturdy. Nothing ever broke them. Phew, that's a relief. Is there no one else here? I expect there would be at least a few maintenance worker. Nope, I never found anyone else. Is that a problem? No, I'm just something I was wondering about. Oh, you're not still spish, are you? You see, she's been telling the truth. Isn't it about time we start trusting her? I'm not so sure. Well, just look at Ryo. He seems to have warmed up right to her. Mommy. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> see, what's well, not to trust? She's been nothing but helpful. And that's after the way Kaido treated her. She's gotta be really nice, well, I suppose. You guys are dumbasses. Hey everyone, the car's here. Never ridden uh, on a cable car before, this is kind of exciting. Get in everyone, this will take us straight to the tower. Worried about Minoru and the others, but I can only go ahead with Kaido for now. Boosies. What the others are up to right now. They could already have taken the cable car up the tower. What is a cable car anyway? Have you ever seen one before? Not in person, but I've seen pictures. It's like a long moving cable with a box attached to it and it if and you ride inside the box. That sounds fun. I want to ride into the box. Maybe we can do that later. Alright! Man, am I bored? I wish we'd get attacked for something. You don't say things like that. I prefer not getting attacked. You don't get it. Boredom is like poison. It saps your will to live, slowly pulling you towards death. True fucking that. Stop creeping me out, would you? 
I'll let him get to you, Takuma. He likes to mess with people, so he'll say random stuff and wait for a reaction. Hey, that's not fair. I often... I very often mean every word that I say. And did you mean what you said just now? Nope. See? <laughs> well, it's clear you two get along. No, it's the wrong one again. You okay, sis? You're not too tired. Okay. Alright, if it starts to get too hard, let me know. Okay. Must have been through for tough for them to going up to the mountain. I'll need to be ready to help too. Miyuki. Watch out for this spot, okay, Miyuki? See how it sticks out? Okay. Here, hold my hand so you don't fall. Okay. Sure does a great job looking after her sister. It's really impressive. You used to be just like that. Really? She was? Never mind. Forget it. Mommy. <laughs> oh, we're up so high. Let me look too. Hey, we're not out here for the fun of it. Try and stay alert. Relax, Shuji. We're practically there. What's the harm of having a little fun? But... But... Disaster could strike at any moment. We must remain vigilant. Oh, you're so strict. Don't you get tired of being on high alert all the time? I hate heights. Yet you can fly. <laughs> it's alright, everyone. We're almost there. We get to the tower. Our cell phone should work. Then we can call for help. This whole wilderness survival nightmare will finally be over. Yes, soon it will all be over. Radio tower is up and running, isn't it? So why didn't you stick around there? Why indeed? <laughs> what are you? If you want something done right, I suppose you must do it yourself. Huh? Did you just... You know, I really am very grateful to all of you. I feel like I should thank you. I don't mention it. Honestly, I'm not even sure why you'd feel that way. Why? Because even if that one little brat got away, now you are all here instead. And there are so many of you, I can't thank you enough. What's gotten into you? I don't get it. I knew it! Fuck it! <laughs> don't worry, I'll be sure to catch your other little friend too. What are you talking about? Mommy? Although, I suppose this is the end of Long the Line for you. Always the same fucking Digimon as well. They use. What? Uh, is everyone okay? What happened? I hit my head. Seems like nobody has any major injuries. Uh, is it just me or does something seem wrong? The car is not moving. That woman, she's gone. What, seriously? Yeah... Rio, behind you. What? Back to the horror time. Every single fucking time, it's the same one! Ugh. Too predictable! It does the same thing every time, the same trick! A spider? Again? What is that thing? A demon? A demon spider woman? Oh no 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 no. It's huge! Wait, what happened to that woman? Not very bright, are you? Or was my disguise just that good? Don't you know better than to trust a stranger? She's smiling. So creepy. I'm Arukeni Mom, but don't worry, you won't need to remember my, my name for long, because you're all about to die. Yeah. Yes, I will offer up everyone in this box sacrifices. Oh no. What are we going to do? Shuji. This is why I didn't want to go exploring, ah! <laughs> I'm scared. No. No, mommy. That's not... That's not my mommy. Of course not. <laughs> of course not. Mommy's not here. Oh, 
Eco, what is it? Hmm, something wrong. What are you looking at, Miyuki? Looks like a cable car. It stopped part way up. Like everyone's trapped inside. Wait, so this was all that woman's plan? Knew she was a monster. What did I tell you? What's going to happen to them? We need to get over there and save them. Right, let's go. Count me in. I'm gonna smash that monster woman's face in. Come on, Drakmon. You got it! It's time to do it! You are the reason this whole world is falling apart. But by sacrificing you and children, we can prevent its destruction. We will be saved. I thought all might be lost when that little girl with the hat got away. But now I can offer up all of you instead. <laughs> so wait, this is that woman? Sneak attack? Huh, what a coward. Takuma, get ready for some action. We're gonna stomp this giant bug and save everyone. Right. Let's do this, Agumon. Yeah! We can only select an o one other extra unit. What the heck is that? Cedarmon, obviously. All annihilated. Little help here. Shh. Pain, hold your horses. We're coming to help. I'm closest, so I guess I'm up first. Let me at him. Setting scene German up. Nightmares. Venom Blast. Don't know what that is. I didn't realize he already had an evolution. Sick. Um.
should have thought this one through a little bit better. What can physical attack boost? Venom trap obtained. Turn. Item. Sucker ability. Break plus. Holy shit, critical kill?
thought I was done for. Thanks for the save. Here's the rest of the party. Now then, time for a little payback. actually get up there. Annoying. Pepper breath. side attack. Why is not 
more damage to this. Let's hope. Nice, that one is at least dead. Serious? No, I'm okay. Is there no actual way for me to get off this spider web? All the way down there. Fight is rough.
Okay, is this close enough? No. This should lure her. Yeah. Spider threat. Evolution into Dover. Attack. She doesn't. Okay, that's nice. Agumon. Uh, but this should. Or not. Hopefully, I can survive a hit. No way! <sighs> Retry. Yeah, of course we're gonna continue on hard. Uh, I definitely picked the wrong Digimon to, like, drag along.
Makes sense. Serious. Rooms. Mr. Blades. Boom! Eom! Shazam! about bad luck.
poisoned as well. That is super crazy. Can we just end this fucker's life already? Danny, yo, Danny, 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 Danny,
Revolution, the Digital Wolf. Yuri, Yuri, the same. Jesus, this place is like a maze. that I could have sent Hobbit into a different direction. But fuck it. I'm gonna start luring.
scene. threat. Evolution, Hulk. Attack, destructive war. Got her. Ex Arcanimum. How frustrating. For all this, I was holding back. I do not like losing to these brats. She was holding back? And she was still that tough? She was just toying with us. <laughs> not exactly. I simply wasn't motivated to fight with all I had. And I had to the ceremony already, too. Oh well, after all. I mean, be the one to make the offering. Right, enough of your blabbing. What did you do with the girl you kidnapped earlier? You really still don't get it. I'm under no obligation to tell you anything. So even now you're trying to pull that crap. You haven't felt enough pain. Kaito, I don't think violence is the answer. Maybe she isn't telling you because she just doesn't know. What? <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you a clever one? You're smarter than you look. Careful, Kaido. Don't get too close. 
There's only one reason she'd be dragging this out. She got something up her sleeve. Oh, give this one a prize. But first, let me bid you adieu. What? Ugh. Damn it, she got away again, that monster. Well, you did all you could. No wonder she was so smug. She was sure she could get away. And she did. I wonder if that's why she didn't feel motivated to go all out. Who knows? Maybe there was some reason... She had to pretend to put up a fight. Well, we can only worry we can worry about that later. Let's focus on climbing the tower for the moment. Victory. Speed break, venom trap, vexing potency crystal. And other things. I don't know who to give these stat upgrades to yet. Help! Somebody help! Please! I thought I heard a voice just now. Don't think that is Arukenimon again, do you? No, they were calling for help. I thought I heard it's coming from around here. Well, if it's help thereafter, it's help they'll get. Wait, you don't even know who it is. What if they want to take advantage of us? Oh, don't be like that. We should help them. Shut up, nobody asks you. What if we made them agree not to attack us in exchange for our help? Yeah, but don't stop there. We could tell them to give us all their food too. That might be... that might as well be a robbery. Hey, I found him. Help! It's Tentomon! No need to worry about him. Poor thing caught in the spider web. Try to get something out of this. Food would be good. I wonder what he has. Maybe we could ask him ask if he knows what happened to Mew. Good idea. Agumon, can you get him out of there? Got it. Oh, I'm saved. Thank you so much for helping me. Hmm. Oh, would you look at that? More human children. How unusual. More? Wait, you mean you've seen others? Right? You are a lot smaller than the one behind you. Could that have been Mew? She was walking around by herself. Well, she's been captured by the terrifying Arakeni one, you see. I couldn't help but take pity on the girl, so I rescued her at the first opportunity. Fortunately, I was discovered by Arakeni Moon and taken prisoner myself. <laughs> What about Mew? What happened to the girl? The girl? Why she ran away? I was right behind her, so there's no doubt about that. She was headed to the shiny place, you see? Great, thanks for telling it to me. And for rescuing Mew in the first place. Oh my, don't even mention it. So where exactly is the shiny place? I'm not sure how to describe it. Why not climb up somewhere and see for yourself? Hey, you think we'd be able to see it from the top of that tower? Good thinking. Let's go up and find out. Phew, we finally made it. You know, I should have thought of this sooner, but how's that old cable car working? Where's the power coming from? Who's keeping it running? It doesn't make any sense. It's the same with the plumbing and at school. Like, how does it, any of it work? Who cares? All I want right now, all I want to know right now is where Mew went. Come on, let's go. Geesh, talk about aggression. What the hell is this? This doesn't make any sense. Why are we surrounded by water? This is supposed to be a mountain range. This is an island? Does that mean we actually got teleported here? This is all getting really crazy real fast. Your school, the shrine, those buildings are all just like I remember, but the geography's all wrong. 
How did this happen? I can't believe this. I feel like I don't know what's what anymore. Everyone, we've got to calm down. Uh, uh, Shuji, you seem more upset than anyone. This can be. It's a shocking sight for all of us, but it must be worse for Kaido being local, and Aoi is actually speechless. It's with the ocean. Is this an island? Even some of those buildings are wrong. Whoa! What's that shiny thing? And that looks like a giant ring! Check out that building covered with steel pipes over there. At this point, we have to be in some other dimension, don't we? It's going to save us. That That's just... Well, we'll have to accept, isn't it? can say that for sure. Come on, let's not give up just yet. But, but, but we... Uh, 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 <laughs> Ryo? I knew it. This isn't the real world. Not a chance. <laughs> this this is the afterlife. Yeah, that's that's it. It gotta be it. <laughs> Ryo, come on, pull yourself together. We're all dead. All of us. But then, what about mommy? Mommy's dead too, of course. That means she's here. I knew it was her. She's here for me, calling for me. Rio, you're losing it. Get it together. This isn't the time or place to start panicking. In situations like this, it's important to keep a clear head and act with paw. Shut up! Ow, you didn't have to hit me. <laughs> Rio, where do you think you're going? It's dangerous out there. This is bad. We have to stop them. Rio is completely losing it. <laughs> it's fine. Everything is going to be fine. I get it now. Mommy's here. I'm going to see my mommy. Mommy! Mommy, it's me! <laughs> Help me! Oh, you poor little boy. <gasps> You want to see your mommy that badly? And come right over here, you poor baby. Uh, you! You're a fake! You're not my mommy. You betrayed me. Mommy would never betray me. Never! She'd be there to save me, no matter what. Don't you see? I'm going to meet my mommy. Got that? Mommy, save me! What? Have you lost your mind completely? Shut up, I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to my mommy. Get lost. Mommy, I've tried so hard for so long. I've been wanting to see you so badly. Come get me, mommy. Come quickly. <laughs> my, my. What a shame. I do believe this child is broken. Now what to do with him? I suppose I ought to perform the ritual and offer him a sacrifice, but what would make him part of this world? Yes, I suppose he'll just have to die. Cyclomon, come here, would you? Yes, Lady Arikenimon. Kill this boy for me, would you? It should be easy enough. I'll leave it to you. Yes, my lady. Very good. I shall return to the altar, then he's yours. I will kill the boy. Huh? What the- hey, stop! What's going on? Mommy! Stay still. You're so hard to, hard to hold. I'll drop you from here, that'll kill you for sure. Ah, help me, Mommy! Shut up, take this! Ugh. Ah, mommy, mommy, save me, mommy! Ah. Stupid boy. Time to end you. Rio! Mm -hmm. uh, what is that thing? Huge one eyed monster? That cyclomon, a brute concerned only with its own power. Don't let the size of him scare you. He's a total buffoon. Yeah, is Ryo alright? 
He's trying to resist. Is he still okay? We need to save him fast. I'm scared, but I'll do my best. Cool! Kunamon says he wants to save Ryo. We're on it. Don't worry, Kunamon. We'll save him. Hurry, Miyuki. Stay back. This could get dangerous. Okay. Okay. Right, everybody. Let's do this. <laughs> Only three Digimon. Floramon is a must, apparently. Sap, you enjoy the rest of your evening, my dude. Talk to you later. Okay. We should, we should be fine. Saki, we should help too. Yeah, you're right, Floramon. You need little what? Hmm? Me? You are holding back. You won't pretend to fight hard. What? No! You do not care about this one, so pretend. Get lost, you nuisance. No, I... I Saki, keep it together. Do I, do I really not want to save Ryo? Am I holding the others back? I, I don't know. I just don't know. Saki, don't let him get to you. I know better than anyone how much you care. You really not want to save one of your friends? I don't know. I just don't know anymore. I did it because it was the good thing to do. I didn't want the others to hate me. But I did. Did I really care about Ryo's feelings? I don't know. What was I supposed to do? Saki, it's okay. Floramon, don't worry. You have an amazing heart. You just do what it tells you. That's all you need to do. What my heart tells me? Ask yourself, Saki. Is it telling you to stop right now? What is my heart telling me? It's it's not telling me to stop. One of my friends is suffering right in front of me, and I'm not about to just sit here and watch. Floramon, lend me your strength. That's the way to go, Saki. Wow, Floramon. Digivolves before Kunamon. Floramon, Digivolve 2. Where are we going to turn into? Into fucking Vegemon? What the shit is this? Vegemon, the strength of your conviction has made me evolve into Vegemon, and now my strength matches what's in your heart. Alright, here we go. I hope you're ready for this, Cyclomon. <sighs> Evolution. Vegemon of all things, Jesus Christ.
this wall damage. Two tools. Bad Cyclone Mon's super strong. We can't let that stop us. We've got to save Ryo. Come on, Agumon, keep it up. Right. Take this. Oh, whoa, Cyclone Mon's attack shook the uh, whole bridge. Wah! Oh no! Ryo, Haru? No way, they fell off the bridge? No, Haru! We've got to save them. Time to warp this up. Now. Crusher Cyclone Moon. Oh, I didn't need. I only need to defeat Cyclone Moon. Good to know. Saint Knuckle. Boom. Right, that monster dropped me and I died. Wait, no, I'm alive, but how? I was up so high. Ah! Oh, it's just you. Oh, don't scare me like that, miserable little brat. That's the thanks I get for saving you? You <laughs> save me? I don't be ridiculous. Well, whatever. Not that I care about you anyway. What was that? I'm gonna have to take that from some little brat. What the hell's going wrong with you? Don't look at me like that. Like I said, I don't care about you. Not at all. You're a monster. Help me, mommy. Ow, oh, you probably shouldn't try to move. You may not have died, but you were injured. Oh, save me. Wait, that's right. I've got my phone. I can call mommy. This guy has completely lost it. It isn't working. Why? Why do you want to return to the real world? I don't don't belong here. This isn't my world. Takuma and the others all hate me. I know, because they all treat me like I'm dead weight. They're trying to use those monsters of theirs to get rid of me. Oh, is that how it looks to you? That's why I want to go back, back to my world, back to my home. But it's okay, any minute now, mommy will call me, and I'll be saved. Just how long are you going to keep deluding yourself? You should know better than anyone that your mother is never going to call you. <gasps> yeah, that's right. Mommy was always sick. I wanted to spend more time with her, but the doctor said no. I tried so hard, whenever I was lonely, she told me to be strong, but those were her last words. Yes, that's right, mommy's dead. Of course she's not going to call. Of course not. <laughs> 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 
Yes, now I get it. Now it all makes sense. I've died, and this is the afterlife, which means mommy should be somewhere close by. <laughs> That's it, isn't it? You're here, aren't you, mommy? Please come and get me. This kid's done for. He's completely snapped. Phew! Well, there you are, but I'm afraid you're too late. Wait, I think I see something. Something in the fog. Yes, it's Mommy. I knew she'd come for me. Mommy, I'm here! You can see for yourself, your precious Rio has lost all touch with reality. You want me to come to you? Okay, wait for me, Mommy. I'll be right there. Ryo, Haru! I found them. They're both okay. Haru. What a relief. Saki, your face is a mess from all those tears. I'm glad we found them, though. Yes, and now we must make haste. The fog is starting to spread. Hey, uh, hey. Come crazy, but Ryo's running into the fog. What? <laughs> mommy! Mommy! <laughs> Ryo, uh, it doesn't sound like he's doing too well. Yeah, I thought I heard him laughing. Oh no, guys, this is not looking good. The fog is getting real dense. You're right, this is bad. You, Haru. You're both in danger. Get over here, quick. Uh, what's that? Looking to where I was pointing, I see a black shadow. Am I seeing things? It looked like some sort of tentacle came out of the shadow. It's heading straight for Yo. Oh man. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. That thing looks like a real bad news. Takuma, stop, Agumon. Isn't there anything we can do? No, not a thing. We... That's just how it works. But no. What's wrong with you? Get out of there. Or yo, you need to run. I think he's saying something. <laughs> Finally get to see you again, mommy. And now we'll always be together. Please don't leave me again. What? <laughs> Fuck, it took him. Huh, what? That's horrible. No way, I can't believe this. No, no. There's Kunimon. I didn't see him there next to Haru. Somehow in a way that... I don't fully understand. I can tell the Kunimon is sad. Not Kunimon too. He's disappearing. It can't be. Kunimon is disappearing. Wait, hold on. Ryo has to still be there, right? No. What? Miyuki? Why is she shaking her head like that? Is she telling me I should give up? Takuma. Haru. What happened to Ryo was he gave up on himself. So this world consumed him. Even after the funk lifted and the shadow vanished, there was still no sign of Ryo. I'm not really sure what Harry meant by what he told me. But I do know one thing for certain. Ryo is dead. Holy shit! After all that, Shuji eventually got us to calm down and we returned to the school. Leave it to Suji to step up in a situation likely that get us all back safely. Kaito was next to recover. He was all ready to go to the amusement park and find Mew. But the rest of us managed to convince him to come back to the school instead. Shuji made the case that we could search more efficiently after we used recruit. And after seeing what happened to Ryo, even Kaito must have realized the need for caution. Everyone else was pretty upset and shaken from having witnessed Ryo's death. It was dark by the time we got back and we were exhausted. Nobody bothered with dinner. 
The others mostly seemed to collapse into sleep, though I found that impossible. My mind kept coming back to the same thought. Surely there must have been something more I could have done. Maybe if we'd all work together, or if I had been more determined, or... I just don't know. It's no use, I can't think of anything. For one more th For one thing, the fog is still a complete mystery, not to mention the shadow. More importantly, deep down, somehow I knew there was nothing I could do. It's starting to get cold. If I stay like this, I'll probably end up getting sick. Even if I can't sleep, maybe I should just lie down for a while. Wow, Ryo just ended up and died. Takuma? Takuma, are you, Takuma, are you alright? You seem kind of out of it. I've been thinking about Ryo. Okay. There must have been something we could have done to save him. Maybe if we started earlier. I knew when we couldn't open up to... When he couldn't open up to Kunimon, when he got scared of Dokugumamon. How he acted in that classroom on the trial, or even just talking with him, it was clear. I knew he was struggling, but I didn't help him. I just let him suffer. What do you think might have changed things, Takuma? We talk more. I wish we I talked more with him. If we'd been talk able to talk things out, even if he just wants to whine or complain, I'm sure things would have ended differently. But it's not like I've got all the answers. Who knows if I didn't if what I did was right, or what I should have done differently. Not me, that's for sure. Takuma, I can tell that you're hurting. You're right, Agumon. I hurt so much. And what's worse is that even after losing Ryo, there's no clear way out of this. Arukenimon is still after us, and maybe that amusement park is crawling with enemies. Plus, if we have been transported to some other world, is there even a way back? I don't know. I just don't know. What are we supposed to do? Takuma. Takuma, listen. I may not know much, but I do know one very important thing. And it's that if you try, Takuma, you can do anything. Whether you team up with the others or just blindly press on, in the end you'll succeed. <laughs> Where is this coming from? I'm not that special, but you are, Takuma. I know it. And I believe in you, Agumon. Thanks, that actually makes me feel better. Maybe now I'll be able to get some sleep. Really? Then I'm glad. Good night, Agumon. Good night, Takuma. Wow, that is... that was kind of unanticipated. Children, but you see, my servants all prove so incompetent. You are allow you allowed them to escape. Clearly, you lack sufficient devotion to our master. N no, it wasn't my fault. I would never. Next time, I'll get that for sure. I'll capture all those human children and offer them up to our master without fail. Yet the altar was prepared. Did you not perform a sacrifice? Have you not only let the children escape, but also failed to provide an offering? Oh, well, actually, that wasn't me. Someone must have beat me to the punch. Yet you did not confirm who this was, or if indeed they made the sacrifice. I did not. But several children still remain. Next time they won't be so lucky. If you're not up to the task on your own, I could always have Mega Cedramon help you. No doubt he would be similarly motivated to prove his devotion to our master. First, let me try. No, I assure you I'm quite up to the task. I won't be needing any help from Monzeomon or Mega Cedramon. Those children will not escape me a second time, you'll see. Ha! Out of my way. 
dare me, who? How crass. Tell me, Garurumon, what brings an outsider like yourself to speak with us? Those traitors who got strong by teaming up with Yunus have turned on us. Oh? And what of it? <laughs> Just what I've been waiting for. I'm gonna crush them all. Hmm. As if brute force will help you accomplish anything. You're such an idiot. What? Are you still up to your old tricks? Refusing to fight your own battles? Ha! Huh. Spoken like true simpleton. Only a fool would insist on fighting their own battles. Ha! Huh. You make me sick. Every last one of you. Enough of this. Hey, she started it. This gets us nowhere, and I see no need for cooperation. Do as you wish. <laughs> as if I'd ever do anything else. So long, bitches. Oh, what a surprise. He shows up, picks a fight, and leaves. Are you sure we can trust him? His skills are undeniable, and he holds a grudge against human children. That is clear. More importantly, in my words, Arikanimon, our master will not tolerate any more failures. I am well aware of that. Who do you take me for? So long as you know, there will be no more second chances. Remember, it's not just Monzeomon and Megasidromon here. There are countless others who could take your place. If you need help, just ask. God, so infuriating. How could those little brats do this to me? <laughs> well, alright then. They can just wait and see. Shit's on a stick though. Ryo died. Now I'm kind of curious to what everyone else is up to. Stop. Not that way, Ryo. Come back. Ryo! Ryo! <sighs> <sighs> You. It was just a dream. Woke up from a nightmare this morning, drenched in sweat, my hands still shaking. It's not surprising, I had a lot on my mind last night, and sleep did not come easy. Not after watching Ryo die right in front of us yesterday. But beyond the terror of watching someone die for the first time, seeing that strange tentacle reach out and grab him was just awful. Just thinking back on it now sends a shiver down my spine. But I shouldn't let myself dwell on it. Not after how Agumon cheered me up last night. Wait, where is Agumon? And everyone else for that matter. Nobody else is here. Am I the last one up? All the more reason to get moving. We need to figure out what comes next. It's not too late, so maybe the others are still in the cafeteria. Good morning, Kaido. Drakmon. Hm. Finally up, are you? Well, seems pretty mad. Has he been waiting for me to wake up this whole time? Sorry, I woke up so late. Hard time getting to sleep. Yeah, whatever. I'm sure you were exhausted. So where's everyone else? How should I know? You're the one who's showed up. Wait, really? I thought for sure they'd have told... been here by now. Where's everybody? All over the place, apparently, and looking pretty upset. They did not... They did see that friend of yours getting taken into the fog right in front of them. I'm sure that's bothering them as much as it is you. It's a good point. Ryo's death didn't just come as a shock to me. It has to be on everyone's mind. They'll need to proceed. Uh, they all need to process what happened. We should probably give them some time. We don't have any time to give. We need to get out there and save me, you true. But with that strange fog, everyone's nervous. All the more reason we should move fast. Mew's in trouble. It's not just the fog, there are monsters after her. That's right. I recarry mom that spider monster said something about a sacrifice. She was really strong too. There are lots of those things like her out there. Damn it. That's why I wanted to find you yesterday. I should have never have let you talk me out of it. No, I never should have taken my eyes off her in the first place. Kaido, calm down. Yeah, listen to Takuma. Shut up, don't tell me to calm down. My sister's life's on the line. It's not like I forget. Forgot, but you're getting mad isn't gonna help anything. You know what's not gonna help? Arguing while waiting for help that's not coming. 
Gonna look for me on my own. Kinda wait. It's too dangerous for you to go by yourself. We all need to stick together. I agree. I don't want you putting yourself in danger, Drakmoon. <sighs> Alright, fine. That's a relief. We managed to get through to him for once. But I'm only waiting around till noon. After that, I'm going. What? I'll wait uh, here till noon, then I'm looking for you, no matter what anyone says. I'll go alone if I have to. Man, you can be such an idiot sometimes. You know I'll be with you if it comes to that. Who are you calling an idiot? You, obviously! Who else would I be talking about? You've probably got some stupid idea about not putting anyone else in danger, don't you? Quit trying to do everything by yourself. What do you think I'm here for? Yeah, I really feel that way. Alright, sorry about that. <clears throat> Adrachmon seems generally, genuinely concerned about Kaido. Kaido does actually seem to listen to Adrachmon in his own way. Might not look like it, but I think those two are actually pretty close. So, Takuma, I guess this means you'd better round everyone up. I'll need to keep an eye on Kaido to make sure he doesn't take off early. Got it. See, so you've got until noon. Oh, no, that's hardly any time. I need to get everyone here quick. Free action. He's still here, though. Episode 1. Yaddy yaddy does he. I think I just need to keep it up and play through the game once first before we go and continue like trying to complete it. After that I think I need to do more research on the game for sure. I'm honestly surprised that uh, Florimon evolved so early. I'm sweating like hell. <sighs> I wonder if Ryo was just supposed to die at that point, or if he like survives in different circumstances, someone else dies? I mean, I didn't give much of a shit about Ryo, that's true. I also managed to fail most of his affinity questions. And I figured he would uh, evolve sooner or later. Uh, oh well. 
So, thank you all very much for hanging out with me tonight. Okay, well, have a fantastic rest of your evening. Sleep well. I'll be back on Monday. I probably won't be streaming tomorrow because, uh, I need to go and have or sit, sit on my dog. I need to babysit my parents' dog because she wasn't allowed to come with, on them with vacation. My little brother has been uh, dog-sitting most of the time but he has a volleyball tournament tomorrow. So, I'll be the one dog sitting this time. Means no stream tomorrow. Uh, I'll be back Monday. We'll just continue. Let's see where this uh, game brings us. Like, oof, really, really something. Didn't anticipate deaths though, like for real. Anyway, that's it. Adios, sleep well, and until the next time.